Okay. He doesn't know. Maybe. Is it live? Piece of shit. It's absolutely live, Daniel. Sec- what if I would have said some wild shit? I was just waiting. And that was the end of it all. Because you decided to send it live, dude. Yeah, why can't I pop this up? Oh, because that's actually an OBS. I forgot that that's a feature in OBS. Yeah, you can still pop it out, though. No, you're going to do yeah, it. you can. All oh, the little three thingers. Right there. No, that's YouTube. That's there. Okay. Where does it say pop out? You already have it popped out. Close the YouTube one. You can pop it out. Bet money. Bet. No. Bet. Bet. I said, bitch. You said it, though, right? Hello. Hi, everybody. Hello, everybody. Um, welcome back. We're the Bourbon Junkies, and it is Tuesday evening at... Is it 9.04? That's not bad. We did start on time Currently with Currently 75.2 in the hut and 69% humidity. Giggity, giggity. I just read that. 30 seconds ago, 74.6. Yeah. And you were like, it's not that bad. No. It's gone up a half you said a it was degree. 76 in here. I rounded to 75 okay. to be a gentleman. You're a real crybaby. Also baby. to exaggerate slightly. Real crybaby. Okay. It, it's not normal in your home to have it be 76. I don't get this. Let me have this. I go home at 66. No. Right, that's normal. Good for <coughs> no. your wife, dude. It's not normal. Oh. Hi, hello, everybody. Sean's hair tight. Dan, um, yeah. Looks Dan's good looking for a, a little disheveled. Why? I look fucking great, dude. I don't know. You look like a fat guy that just ran. I look great right now, dude. Swollen? Right. Swollen? Like a bee sting. Uh, lifted more this week than you did. Allergic reaction to Bitch. something. It's Tuesday. Bitch. I mean, in the last week. Okay. I was on vacation. Lifted three times. Okay. 66 is ideal, Sean, says Lynn's cat. True. Mm, false. Okay, guys, listen, we have a lot to talk about. Dan does. There's a giveaway that's happening tonight. We need somebody to keep track of them for us. Ricky, what'd you have for lunch? No, Ricky. Oh, didn't. what you had for lunch. What did I have? Yeah. Just a burger. David Rubio a burger. sent you guys the new 2021 chip challenge. You'll like this. He's, no. He, he messaged me this on, no. his, on Facebook. I said, oh, thank God. Couldn't have been happier that you sent us that. It'll be there on the 19th. Welcome back, Sean. So there's a new chip challenge. It's probably worse. I literally can't do that. Not for a while. Yeah. We'll talk about that. We'll put it in his glass. No, I, that's probably what kicked off everything last year. That chip <laughs> challenge. Probably. I never even thought about that. That actually just put a hole in you. And then yep. you've been dealing with it ever since. Dan, what'd you have for lunch? Not nah, a burger, dude. I told you guys. Yeah, hey, yeah, fellas, no. I'm not that good of a mod, says Alec. I Kelly mean, said I can do it. Kelly, thank you so much. We have a bunch of stuff. We're going to do one, I two. I said 92% humidity uh, here in Rhode Island. Chris Spregu said, hey, gentlemen, welcome back, Sean. Thank What's up, buddy? You. So we're doing seven Mr. giveaways Pace. tonight. Don Thompson said, good evening, BJs. I'm in for the drawing. Hell yeah, buddy. Quick, thank go through it you. before they, they okay, figure it out. Seven Seven things. And we're going to go through this again in about a half an hour when, like, more people are probably nah. here. No, we're not. We can't see how many people are. Oh, that's in the top right. Okay. Josh Randall said, light time sent me. Oh. <clears throat> we're all turned up, by the way. <laughs> Listen, Joe Sullivan. Oh, we want the good looking one back. Sean, fair. go get Knox. He's talking about me. Oh, my bad. <clears throat> Did Ricky cut her hair really short? <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, listen. So we're doing a giveaway. There's seven things. Hit the people. These with. are going to be in completely random orders, so deal with it. Um, we got a star camp. I almost said starlight. I went with camp. We got uh, a high. One, one sec. Oh, I yeah. got to click it, but before, people need to see these. Yeah. Yeah. Throw it on over to the. I look yeah. disheveled. I look amazing. Boom. Joey sent us those. New clickers. They go up to a th- is is mine at six nine six nine, possibly. They go to nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine. So I have to reset it. Give Dan a solid. We're gonna keep track of. I'm each gonna others. go with two on that. Joey one. sent me because you tried twice. Joey sent me a golden savant clicker, and I like it a lot. Joey, thanks, buddy. About Joey, Josh Josh coffee came today. Can't wait Hell to yeah, brew man. it. Which one did you get? It was real. Steve Roland, cheers. I need some notes, some starlight. Drinking it now, and it's wild. Vanilla. Oh, it's wild. The finish Strawberry. goes for days. Red fruit, sweet. Mm-hmm. Creamy. Oh. I don't know how many you want. I just want to pet Klein's new puppy. Oh, it's a, it's a cutie pie, dude. 
Okay, so that's the dog that Gabby attention. wanted. It is mm-hmm. that breed. It's probably gonna be a way better dog than Knox. So Stephen Moore with five. <laughs> Eli Cook been drinking for eight hours now. Jeez. Time for more bad decisions. Oh, Cheers, guys. That's a long time. I uh, have a glass of water. Okay, giveaway tonight. Hey, BJ, have a good evening. Thank you, Justin. Thanks, buddy. Listen, uh, four ninety nine and up gets you in the giveaway. Just so everybody knows, cover shipping most of the time. This is a high camp flask, and it's engraved with bourbon junkies on the side of it. It's one of the one cuppers. It's a uh, 375. You can fit a yeah. 375 in here. They're convenient. I've These taken mine a couple times. Ass. The tops are magnetic. They unfortunately cost a lot of money. We yeah. did these uh, as like a Patreon only thing for some tiers last year, but I always order extra of the stuff in case something happens in shipping. So yep. this is one of the ones that we didn't have to, we didn't have any break in shipping. Usually when copper, I travel with so. stuff, I take that. I take those every, I take mine everywhere. They don't spill. Yeah. Hey, one second. Embellish Podcast got both the coffees. Yeah, so have and then Don Thompson said, origin. member for 10 months. Proud hey. to be here. Proud to be. You know what? We're proud to have you here, Don. Don Thompson's such a he's mafia there. name. It's crazy, dude. Like he's murdered people for sure. Or no, I think he's ordered it. Oh. Don Thompson's not the bottom. He's the top. Oh, okay. I'm Don Thompson. Okay. Just like that. That was a good mafia accent, dude. No. Pretty good. Pretty good. Sting the third. Happy Tuesdays, What's fellow up, junkies. Thanks, man. Master Mustache. 499 yes. does get you entered, buddy. Thanks for the super chat. Joshua Fuente. The, the, one, one of for the, the Fuentes. Drawing. One of the Fuentes is here. Elephant in Cigar Oregon. Fuente. Flying avocado. That's a really good name. They don't have them there. Maybe a, Zoos. a zoo. Yeah. They don't have them in the wild there. Yeah. Not intentionally. You're big enough. They'd, they'd call you an elephant there. Okay. Tim Norris, good evening, okay. gentlemen. You know Love the channel. Time to spill some blood. <laughs> Listen, somebody said in our port, our Bowman Port video... There's more giveaway stuff. Hold on. Somebody said in the po- Bowman Port video, they said, oh, this is before Dan wanted to stab Sean. You know what I cut out of that video? I'm going to say it on here. This is not monetized. You, you actually said uh, oh, that it was in a, so a much comment. Yeah. It was so much worse. That I threatened to stab you. No. Oh. You said you were going to shoot me in the face with a gun. Oh. And I was like, we can't leave this <laughs> in the, the video. <laughs> uh, thanks for the five. Can't say your name. Jason Turco. I've got some cool Tombstone Trading Company swag hey, coming. We'll be man. sending you guys some. I wear the other shirt all the time, buddy. Uh, Tim Norris said, good evening, Joan. Love I already said that Thanks, one. Buddy. The Appreciate one below it. it that I can't say his name is where we were at. Ricky said that Sean and Gabby can stream live on the 7th because we're gone climbing a mountain. I thought you said you weren't going to be missing a Tuesday. I'll be at Mythology on Tuesday. Mm. Yep. It's been scheduled. Oh. I thought you weren't going to miss a Tuesday. I didn't know. You looked me in the eyes and said, I don't know. You missed so many Tuesdays, dude. Fill one in. You know what I mean, dude? All right. So anyways, so listen. Also, Bourbon Junkies Coffee Cup that we don't sell anymore from SHS Stonewares, who these are from. This thing's my, like, I I absolutely love this coffee cup. The Pot Belly one or whatever. Pot Belly mug. Um, We'll do. Shield said, give me all your swag. Dear Lang. Okay. Just got the brave little toaster enjoying the. Oh, it's so good. I like Thanks, that. Thanks, Jen, for making a great lot. pick. Yeah, that one was another one that got a lot better than I remember. What? The Starlight? Yeah. Mm-hmm. The uh, It's one entry for each Super Chat point. Uh, when we did our second new loot, that was one that we were like, damn, that got way better. Yeah, well, here's the thing. The difference is that I know for sure the new loot didn't have this happen because the new loot got out so fast. The Starlight sat in a barrel for another two or three months yeah. after we picked it. Yeah. So we got fortunate it worked that's out. what happened with it. Oh, wow. It happened. I'm Fraser. Have you guys had the new Lagavulin Offerman edition? Mm-hmm. It's really good so no. far and also in for the giveaway. We have no. not. Joshua Fuente. Is it one entry for each super chat? Yep. Yeah. It is. Thank you, buddy. Okay, listen. Before Sean does that, because there's more stuff, I'm going to throw Liquid IV, little samplers, in all the giveaways, by the way, number one. Number two, this is probably my favorite thing. Switch to Sex Cam 2, please, sir. Oh, yeah. Let me... Uh... Do they all I come love through that like we that now? That, why? why is why is Dubby Cannon coming through like that? Oh, so they changed this happened last week. Oh, YouTube changed it so if you super chat as a fam, oh, then it shows up with how long you've been fam and your shit's all green. Oh, I like it's it. It's so cool. Bam. I change it. Nope. That's a gosh dang it. That one. Okay, listen. They're very close. This is the Bourbon Junkies Asian or neat glass. Oh, the camera's doing the thing. Or it's super choppy. But oh yeah, I don't know why I was doing that. This is gold. There's gold inside of it. It will never wash off. You can't feel it. It's not engraved. It's actually inlaid into the glass. This is an Asian Ornate glass. We're going to launch these probably in the next couple months, I'd imagine. Yep. We have three of them right now. This is the only sample that we have that we're giving away. So you'll be the first person to have one of these. This is 
like we always talk about how much we love Agent Orny glasses. This one is the coolest one. Of all. I I got right. mine out to drink tonight. Oh, we'll just leave it there. We're gonna do this too. Bam! How many of these? One, two, three, four. We're gonna do two of these. Two bourbon junkies frosted Glens, and then we'll do two bourbon junkies frosted KBTs. Boom! There's a giveaway. They'll all come with unsaid gifts as well, and <laughs> and liquid IV. Almost died. Almost sent it. Oh, I feel like I got some reading to do. Oh, look at all those peoples. Learn how to read. Oh, they're re- Daniel, and Daniel. coffee. We'll give away coffee. Just join Patreon. Have to be here. Thank you, sir. There's a lot of stuff. Ken the Martin. Need to give away. Good evening, gentlemen. Love the Knox Longport t-shirt. Just came in today. Ooh, Cheers. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hell yeah. Liberty Night License. Welcome to BJ Bam. Thanks for being here. Appreciate the membership. I just ordered a sample of the new shirt that I made, had made by our illustrator. You just sucking a dick. Might um, be my favorite one. Fellas podcast. Honestly, you just need a live stream. Let them dish. Dude, that'd be so... So nice. What? A live stream. Like, we don't have to do it? Yeah. Oh. A Tuesday off. Good luck. To us. Justin. To- you and I are canceled, by the way. Just got an over oh, sure. Yeah. Agent or travel decanter, and it's amazing. I gave one to my brother. He really likes it. Agent or travel decanter? It's the one. Oh, that- yeah, yeah. 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 With the two cups. It comes at the full ca- thing. The yeah. high camps are, and the, those are very Not similar glass, to one though. another. Yeah. yeah Taylor true. Cohen just stopped by... Old Raleigh Distillery in North Carolina. Y'all want a sample of their sourced blend? I don't know. Is it good? Maybe. <laughs> if it's good, yeah. Taylor, Taylor, no, good? no. Toshi. Cheers, junkies, on first vacation over two years. Congratulations. In Maui, waiting to check into an Airbnb. What better way to kill some time than watching a live at 3 p.m.? Just need to find... A oh, fly just landed on my nose. <laughs> I just need Lord to find some now. bourbon now. Idiot. Master Mustache, thank you for the five. Thanks, buddy. Oh, we're going to give away two, one single origin coffee and then one of the dark roast blend coffee as well that we just did. It sold out on Patreon. Irish Ted said some Hudson in the big recliner. Settle so in many, for some laughs. So many giveaways right now. I'm gonna Ryan track Bootler. This. I'm just going to roll it. I'm, yep. You guys are awesome. My starlight comes tomorrow. Yes, dude. It's so good. Yeah. It, I love it, man. I really do. I was surprised how, I was surprised how much I liked it. Oh, wow. Which is Tommy weird. D hanging with birthday boy Grease right now. Have fun. See you in a bit. What? Oh, he, are, are Tommy, are they doing their... Are you literally putting that in front of the fucking camera? What else do you want to show them? I guess nothing. I'll move it if we want to show Kick the camera something. off. David Smith, damn. I need to be fam. Aged and or neat glass, not agent orange neat glass. Aged and or Tony G. <laughs> <laughs> Jacob Buchanan, the neat glass is fire. Knee glass is so good, man. It really is. Venezuela says, hashtag Team Stroke Wagon. Nailed it. Love it. Cheers, buddy. Nick frosted Shelley, glass I'm here for the glass. S- Somebody said frosted glass hurts my skin. Uh, Jason Turco said, nice water ring and sex cam, too. Water ring? Yeah. Oh, on the table? There's a water ring on the yeah, table. for sure. Yeah. Uh, Limpscat says, I want it on this. Gah. Giveaway. Gah. Okay. And Jillian Jimenez. Put me in there. Joshua Fente, welcome to EJ Fam. Thank you for the membership. Thanks, I appreciate buddy. you for being Thanks here. Thanks for joining, man. Tony G, did you say Agent Orange? No, Tony, I answered your question without the super chat. Tim M is trying to get me killed, adding to Sean's Turbo Fund. Guys, it's actually on the way. <laughs> it's not. It's supposed to, he's shipping it here, though, so Gabby yeah, doesn't it's know. It's never going to happen. That's Alex, told me. kill him. Like Dan, taking a break from the bourbon for a couple of days, but I'll happily have some bush oh, lattes chilling hey, with you guys. You got to get those bush apples. apples dude. That's that, really a bushel of apples. The apple is where it's at, and they're limited, so they're not going to be around. They'll probably like re-release next yeah, year. Yeah, they do it like once a year. But you, I know, but they just started last year. Yeah, I'm saying like don't wait because you're Kinda not going like to get you're them. Dieting once you're a year. You're not going to get them in four months, is what I'm saying. Brian Dewell, Drewello. How we doing, boys? Get this fucking buddy, fly out of here, by the way. Dan, I will resub right now on Twitch if you will give me an extra entry right now. No deal. Elephant in Oregon. <laughs> <laughs> laughing with a lemon. Sean said no deal, Joe. I'm sorry, buddy. Strawberry liquid IV? Well, there's watermelon there. There's, like, pina colada over there. There's guava over there. There's a I think that says there. Anima Fan. Uh, any plans to review the new Kirkland Bottle and Bond? We didn't got any. How is that what you read when it's one Mega Man fan? Oh, sure. You're an <laughs> idiot, dude. Mega Man, hey it. Mega Man is on. His picture is of Mega Man. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's such a good video game and so much harder than I remember. Yeah. I bought it on Steam. Drastically more difficult than you think it'd be. Tormentor, 3080. Dan going to be 
Dan going to be gone. Looks like it's time to break some more Savant stuff, Sean. You know, I read it, and There's then I was like, to break. what can I break? I already broke. Grease broke my heart when he beat me. Dennis Gilmore, thanks for all the tips you give us, and I'm greedy and hope for sweat. <laughs> God damn it. JD. What's up, Haywood? Hey, Saw you in Cheers chat. How you doing? Yeah, Haywood is in chat. Cheers, Sir Rockwell. I don't know where I was at. I don't know where I was at. Mm. Ah, right there. Michael Highholzer. What's up, fellas? What kind of knives do you guys have? I've got my Benjamin bug out tonight. Alec, what, what kind of knives you guys have? Shit! The new Vero Engineering, dude! But you know what? We need the sex cam, too. We need her again. You're right. Uh, Drew, the, uh, the coffee should have shipped already. All the coffee has shipped, 100%. Literally. Packed her, shipped her, sent her. Give it... Oh, my. Vero... Okay. Put it fucking back <laughs> right now. Put it back. I'm moving the... We got stuff in the way. Okay. okay. You're... Okay, go. Put it back. Oh, oh my gosh. Put it. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Find out how sharp it is. All right, wait. Where were you? You lost your, oh, you I'm lost a, your spot. A, a, You're an moved. idiot. Yep. You're terrible nope, at this. Nope, nope, No, you weren't that far down. Yeah, yeah, right now. There it was. These fuckers are giving away $50 worth of stuff and getting $1 million in Super Chat. <laughs> well, hey, That's a good return. Chicken ash, as you would say it. If it makes you feel better, that high camp flask was $85. If that That's makes you feel any better. <laughs> our cost. Tony St. Philip. I'm in on that neat glass. Oh, me too. I love it. Can we get a Dan adjusting a shirt counter? No, this only goes to 9,000. Listen, fat people adjust their shirt. I'm sweaty and it's hot, dude. I don't know We're you not want. moving soon there, Jason. Who's moving? He said clearing out the hunt. No, there's soon? just a lot of stuff in here. This is all in the, all of like, we have so much extra stuff that we hold back when we sell stuff. In case, like, insurance reasons. Justin so. Alford with the four ninety nine. <clears throat> Nicholas Jones missed What's a up, coffee buddy? sale. Here's my doing? chance. One more cast. Cheers. Welcome back, Sean. Glad to have the band back together. Ugh. Tuesday's rock. Ugh. Jamie's wishing Grees a happy birthday. Come on, Jamie. Is it his birthday today? Today? Yeah, it is, for real. I thought it was yesterday. No, it's today. Hey, I him today. somebody who is um, one of their patrons, Tommy D's in here. They're doing a bar night. They're not yeah. doing a, oh, they're doing a bar night or a OnlyFans or whatever they call it. What do they call theirs? Tell, Tommy, tell Grease, <laughs> I said. A town hall. He's, I love him. And happy birthday. And you know what else? Tell him he cheated. So. His wife didn't even. Ah, oh, Andy oh. McGann. 20. Watch him from Norman. Okay, Boomer Sooner. <laughs> I need, I will restart the stroke Kraken right now. If Okay, Joe. Sean already said no, Joe. Sean no. already said no. No. <laughs> Sean said no. Paul Hawks, cheers. Thanks for being my entertainment during a late night work. What, would you stop? I want to know if it's on or off. I don't know. You just keep pushing. Legion. Never there we gonna go. Give up. Fine. Yep. Going with the Rick roll. What? Never going to give you up. Never going to let you down. Never going to run around and desert you. Desert you like the food. You get it? You're it's fat. the same word. Robert. No, it's not. It's, it's, it's spelled, spelled differently. It's spelled identically. Second S. That fan just hit my... Robar. I also missed the coffee sale. Hoping you give <laughs> a few bags left over for a giveaway. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, we got like five bags left. So we're doing two tonight. Uh, your turn. We'll Reading a couple, two bitch. a different night. Uh, 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 <coughs> wild amount of giveaways. Got to hop in. Two EDC pen recommendations. Yeah, dude. I got one for it. You had to get up to fucking do it. Get my pen? Yeah. Sex cam too, dude. We just need to set a hotkey so you don't have to click things, you know? Okay, no you did it yeah, again. You're really bad at this. There it is, dude. Copper. Little, uh, what you would call it? What do you call this? It's like a, it's like it's a. It's a fucking pen. No, but it's What do you mean, what do called, I call? Okay, here you go. It's called Everyone going to hear this one. What is this type of pen called? A pen. No, no, no. See the clicker thing? The clicker? Yeah. Bolt action. That's called a bolt action pen. This bolt action pen was like $50 instead of like a million dollars, like all the other bolt action pens. And I have no idea what brand it is. Okay, can you read a few more? I'm gonna drink some Sorry, President's the, Choice. Leo, it is like, uh, it's like, it starts with the RE or something like that. The logo. It's a 16. It's not from, I know who it's not from. I don't know what it's actually from. Holy shit. Pool. You are so far in the fucking weeds on I'm this. I'm trying to help him. He donated a super chat. I'm trying to help the man out. 
You got an idea for EDC pen? Sean carries a flashlight. He doesn't carry a pen. I don't carry a pen. I mean, for a couple cheers, everyone. Cheech or all, you know, said Tim Edwards said, cheers, fellas. Here's for that glass. You're fucking just living in the bayou. Wanda so Hammer set. Me. Is that a sex name? What? Wanda Hammer. Not, it's not, is it? Wanda Hammer feels like I spit it out. If it is, I did it. <laughs> What's in the bush? Apples, if you get the right one. Hey, Sean's back. Said nobody ever. Team Dan Savant's trophy. Wagon. I love you, Zach. Somebody get up there, Zach. <laughs> Congrats on your house, you fucking <laughs> asshole. <laughs> uh, Zach Haddon, the starlight is great. Blows the pick I got from Party Source out of the water. That's what I like to freaking hear, dude. I'm going to be honest. Well, that's bad. You won't even like it. That starlight is my favorite starlight I've ever had, personally. Need more POV. That means point of view. We got those. We got the ones like the camera setup that goes on the top's head. You know what I'm Fucking saying? Tim. Sean, I'm not trying to get you killed. Now you have ten dollars free towards the turbo. <laughs> free dot money dot. Uh, YouTube takes thirty percent. That's seven dollars towards oh the turbo. Oh my gosh! Don't forget it. Elephant in Oregon said enemas, bro. And I don't know why it wasn't a super chat. I just read it. Drink some King Kentucky <laughs> tonight. Fuck it. I'm reading these. I are like where your head's at there, Joe. Buy a bug of salt off Amazon. Here's the problem. Do you have to, you got to wait till they land, right? For that to work. What? The bug assault gun. Yeah. And the problem is I don't want salt everywhere. I mean, you could shoot it like skeet. You're probably going to miss though. There it is. Got the fan. Nailed it. Perfect timing. Jared O'Connor. Cheers, Junkie. Did a blind this past weekend with your Knob Creek pick, your new riff pick, and a Blave Little Toe Star pick. Casey's a hitter. Hashtag not Team Sean. I think that says Team Sean. David King. Cheers, Junkie. Thanks for the Patreon swag. Hey, thanks for being here, man. We appreciate it. Thank you guys for the support. Um, Roscoe said the bug of salt works. Yeah, so I've heard a bunch of people. Dan and Julia are here. What's up, guys? Hey. I've heard a bunch of people say that they work. The problem is if I shoot salt at that board. Everything's rusted there's salt. Here. Yeah, there's salt everywhere. It's so yeah. humid in here. Yeah. You guys are old news. Bring back Ricky. Oh. Hashtag Team Ricky. JK, love you guys. Cheers. Hey, Nate. She'll never be on the stream again because you are a bunch of adults <laughs> who act like fucking toddlers. I just want you all to know Oh, that. is that the $400 knife? Okay. Dan's well, knife we want will to talk be about it. <laughs> dull in two weeks, and then we'll be useless like the rest of his knife. I think I just talked about that in a video. Literally I said, how long? Knives. No, you don't. I sharpen knives. You pull it through that piece of shit that doesn't do anything. It literally does. No. It's literal science. Dude. No. Ivan Indrelin says, uh, Dan getting hard for gas station. Ivan, I will literally open hand slap you, and you might beat the <laughs> shit out of me after that, but I'm going to slap your face, dude. Sipping on a Wilderness Trail straight bourbon pick. This is from Jerry Black. Four years, 112 proof of greatness. Can't wait for y'all's. Uh, your knife feels awful. I'm. This is the best crafted knife I've ever felt. Like this, ever, you're the period. person that paid like a thousand dollars for a like a two hundred dollar bottle, right? No, I'm not. And you're just convincing yourself. No, I paid retail for it. It's this. amazing. I paid retail. Yeah, I know. I did. This I is retail. Yeah, that's a forty dollar knife. Oh wow. Okay. Okay, listen to me. I know you're supposed to know things about knives because you're redneck. You grew up in the in the forest, literally with wolves and shit, like yep. the guy from the Jungle Book. Yep. Okay. Tarzan. <laughs> we talking Mowgli. Mowgli. I could be Tarzan. I couldn't be Mowgli. No, because Tarzan's impressive. Mowgli's kind of a little bitch. So we're going with Mowgli on this one. Okay. Chat will agree. Listen, that there is not a single negative review about how great Vero engineering. Yeah, knives they just are. delete it. They. What if it's on YouTube? Delete. Taylor from Best Damn EDC has a couple of Vero knives, and he's madly in love with them. He's, what does that he, guy know? He probably has a good one. What is the Not that one. Exact same model, different color. Okay. Get fucking Did wrecked. you like that one? He loved it. I hate he said one. the only thing he didn't like about it was this clip on, he has the first version. This is not, this is a newer version. The knife. This clip was <clears throat> higher, so when he grabbed it, it pushed into his fingers. He didn't mm. like that. Mm. They have since moved it down, so it goes between your fingers. So what's up, idiots? Okay. What kind of knife is it? Vero Engineer. All right. I guess Dan's version of Town Hall is OnlyFans. Yep. That's where we talk to everybody. Thanks, Ivan Dave. said, I am not Haywood Jablomi. I know I need a blowjob, though. Love Got it. Both. Steve Dan around. Cheers, guys. That's all. Thanks, buddy. Bourbon Beginnings. Thanks for guys. Starlight came today. I hope you love it, Ooh. man. Dessert versus desert. Dan can't spell either. Nope. Hmm. Toshi Bake said, not a regular cigar guy, but I grabbed an eight. Maybe Nika Puro, since y'all speak so highly about him. Can't wait to get to that one in the new mm. label. Um, so Matt says that this year's new label 1920 is absolutely outstanding. 
Oh. So we need to buy one and see if it's different. Because that's I mean, a, you'll drink through that. That's a new bottle, later. old 1920. Of I know. Old 20? Jeez, oh, yeah, but you just drink it like it's water out here. It basically glugga, glugga, glugga. It literally is intended to be drank. proof water, yeah. It's intended to be consumed. Yeah. I love the Toastar headed to work. Thanks, Dad. Appreciate it, man. How much did you have? What? <laughs> 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 Loved it. Killed it. And I'm going to work. Joe Villet. Can't stick around for the live tonight, but got to get on the strike giveaway. Going to catch a replay tomorrow during work. Cheers, boys. Thanks, we'll fine. run the giveaway at 11-ish, and Heavy on the you ice. have to email us at bourbonjunk at gmail.com if you win. For those of who, you, who have just joined, because there's a lot more people in here than when I initially said it, there's a Starlight uh, 375 Camp flat. Fucking Starlight again. There's a High Camp 375 flask that's copper engraved with bourbon junkies on it. There's an ancient ore glass with gold in it. There's a bunch of frosted stuff. There's going to be liquid IV, and then there's going to be things to christen things with, all that kind of stuff. Neil Solomon, any pair suggestions for the Cigar Club Customs this month? Just got mine. We don't oh, have it we yet. We don't have them yet. We don't. Because that's what I was going to talk about that when we talked about Cigar Club in a little bit, because they yep. just did another Customs. Ours are not here yet, though. Mm. Um, Just got mine. They smell outstanding. Listen, Cigar that Club Customs, like we-, we can talk about it a little bit. My favorite subscription service period i love yeah if you only cigars. smoke a couple cigars a month i think that's the best way to go i love the cigars that come out of that uh both for sale tonight at 11 p.m one gold inlaid bj branded agent or rocks glass interesting trades considered ps apex legends is the best game ever i see a lot of people are switching to that everybody's switching because there's so many cheers in warzone but both hates apex legends because he's never played a multiplayer game except warzone so he mm. thinks it's the best ever mm-hmm. and so he can't get over the fact that like nobody's climb. playing the, his game oh you know what i mean what'd you say <laughs> that you can climb <laughs> yeah exactly you can move around actually ricky dan never gives me free stuff i have so i have i got one just lined up right now Hateful or it was free last night. So oh, Bourbon Kingdom, wait, I, are you guys finally drinking my PC samples I sent? Let's go. Yeah, we are, dude. Pres- we got the President's Choice chilling I got, up uh, there. Sixteen right here. Aiden. Nine year, four month, one hundred eighteen proof. Dan will hate it. I set it over here. Eat me. That was Aiden's that super chat. I shouldn't say these. And Felt have aggressive you when who, you looked in my eyes and I said just it. I wanted you to know. Okay. How I feel like that was Did his intention. It, do you think we needed the eye I contact? I feel like though? we need to reenact some of these super chats. That's fine. We need context. These are texts. We need tone. Okay. I'm adding the tone. I get it. Aiden looks both in our eyes. Yeah. One somehow literally at the same time. Like an iguana. And goes eat me. Okay. <laughs> Ring him out of it. <laughs> my doctor at the VA hospital told me that I need to stop drinking today. So cheers to you, doc. Drink some Jack Daniels. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, I don't know. Sometimes nah, it's a that good. That one laughed. That one laughed on sometimes me. Sometimes it's a good idea to listen to your doctor though. Um, be careful. Josh McCannahan. Mac, nope, McMahan. Look forward to Tuesday night every week. Thanks, guys. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate it, man. Ryan. See, David Goldman said shooting, shooting bugs in the air is like shooting clays. Yeah, but you shoot clays outside. Yeah. You see the difference? Yeah. You shoot bugs inside. Okay. The mess when you shoot clays is outside. Yeah. Just salt. <laughs> this is, yeah. Just all of your computers that you'll eventually shoot and ruin. <laughs> when all those monitors are absolutely destroyed. What happened? Bug assault. Hey, fellas, today is my husband Brandon's birthday, and we started the day with some BJ's Dark Roast. Now we've moved down to Booze. Cheers, fellas. Hell hey, yeah. thanks for Hope being here. Cody Lee. Welcome back, Sean. Enjoying the starlight tonight. Cheers, fellas. Is this that was a- my pick, by Ryan the way. Annals. I'm going to say that name, but I didn't want to say it quickly. I didn't want to move through that one just in I case. I think that's Rain. Greg Wood. Always enjoy you guys. That wasn't. That was an intentional pause. I didn't mess up a single word. Retract that one. Roll it back. Uh, I'll, I'll give you a free pass okay. for the next one. But there was a <laughs> there was a pause. Dramatic pause there. Have you ever, I'm a professional actor sipping on some 19. Okay. There. Nope. I get no. No. I get the free one there. I know. I know. I sipping on the, some 1792 bottle and bond. Trying to nice. decide between. Fuck. Click it. But did between. <laughs> Between Cocoa Krispies or Lucky Charms for a pairing. 1792 Mile Mon, you have Thoughts. to go Cocoa Krispies because the banana will overwhelm the Lucky Charm. Joshua Fente, just spreading out some super chats. Appreciate it, buddy. They're all randomized, so it doesn't matter yeah. when you send them. Uh, Alex said you can probably cut a lot of pickles with that knife. I have a story for you <laughs> that you don't know about yet. Oh, I, he told me about it. Okay. I saw the picture. Never did I think at the age of 27 I listened to two grown men argue for three hours every <laughs> Tuesday night for fun, but here I am. Thanks, Jared. Dan said, of course we're here. Not completely here. Hey, I think Kyle. I drank some odd blends or something. Yes. I remember chugging some McAllen a while ago. Other than that, blank. So Dan L is absolutely blasted right now. I like it. Yeah. He said he remembers McAllen and nothing else. Is Dan, you say yes? 
Yeah. It's not that bad. It's pretty bad. We just don't love it's it. It's pretty bad, Kyle. Disco fuck, not great. Oh, okay. I'm trying to get Peter to Lang, at Bourbon Junkies. By the way, Mucho thanks to the guys at Outfitters. The delivery is packed so well. It's, it's like so good. pulling 81 <laughs> millimeter mortars from the crate. 100%. You know what that's like, Tim? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, um, me and Night Angel got together. Okay, Tim, man. Dan's yeah. knife is one one fifteenth of a new turbo. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm up to 15. And here's the good news. Sean. Sean's thir- 14 fifteenths is, he paid, it's on the way here. Tony G said, Team Mowgli, Team Sean, Team Little Biatch. <laughs> we need to make a fucking ripoff. Oh. I'm Mowgli. I You're just we, fucking we get, blue. We get sued for You big-ass gummy bear. We get sued blue. For that. Fuck you on the gummy bear. I'll shut this stream down immediately, oh, dude. Oh, gummy bear himself. Oh. What is this? Oh, I'm drinking Old Carter. I'm like, this does not smell like President's Choice to me. It smells like light whiskey. Uh, oh, Eric. How's it hanging, guys? Long-time watcher and patron. Left. First-time donor. Wife and I do with our first child future drinking nice. buddy September 18th. Any bottle recommendation to pop at the hospital? What do you got, dude? Tag us in chat with, like, yeah. give us five options. Colin don't, Murphy. You don't have to super chat again. Have, have y'all had... Have y'all... <laughs> Damn it. I was, what? Have y'all had the AL-8 on y'all's Kentucky adventures yet? Or what? You know what AL-8 is? No. Did you throw... Kentucky, KY. You said Kentucky? Kentucky. Did you forget to say it. Kentucky. Tea? Kentucky. I don't know what ale eight is. Ale eight is uh, it comes I also in had a, to read it slow. I know you did. You know I, was, well, I looked over and I'm like, oh, he thinks it's a bad word. Ale eight. I like how I call those bad words, but I drop. Dan L left one of my favorite comments I've read on any video we've ever done last Friday. Roy Jackson, thanks for the. Go ahead. Thanks, buddy. Don't scroll on because I want to talk about the ale eight real quick. Um, okay. You can't remember that? I went to drink the shot. Yeah. And I said, fuck my mouth. Oh, yeah. And Dan goes, Oh, yeah. Dan can just say that and get away with it, apparently. And I'm like, if you would drink that, you would feel the same way. It wasn't good. I created a monster. Dude, I showed Ricky your King Kentucky pour. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, it annoyed me the second time I saw it. <laughs> it annoyed me so much. Someone was like, wow, really heavy. Yeah. I was like, am I not a generous guy? <laughs> um, okay, the ale comes in this green bottle. Is it, yep. is, it, um, is it pop? Is it soda? Is that what ale is? Um, you can't ask the it's chat. Either, when it's, it's either not soda moving. or beer. You can see it on the right. You can watch it on the right. That's why I was moving that up. Um, you, it's either it's either pop or beer, and I can't remember which. It's a cherry bomb. It's technically a late one. I don't what. I like you guys are using words that I understand less. Yeah, you just go ahead. But it comes in this green bottle. It's got a really cool logo, and it's like famous um, locally for like Chicago or some shit okay. like that. I don't or Ohio. So is it like Verner's? I don't know what it tastes like. I've never had it, but I've seen it a bunch. Okay. Zachary G. Sup, fellas. Sean, happy to see you back. Thanks. Uh, thoughts on Wilderness Trail Rye. Cheers. Uh, let me tell you. We had a few, and they're really good. We had three samples we've to choose three, from. All three were good. But we've only had three. Yeah. So. Avery B. Haven't watched in a while. Have to be back. Me too. I'm About to crap open a Penelope store pick. Awesome, man. I, hey, I bet it's awesome. We've oh, never had a bad Penelope store Not pick yet. ever. Literally. Adultish Gambino, buddy, you're you're just wrong on that, and we'll get into that later, okay? Mm. Brent Derringer. Listen to while driving to work. You guys are great. Thanks for being here. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate it. You're great. How about that, dude? Not an iguana, a chameleon. Sean's an idiot, cheat. So, you know, it is what it is. Somebody boot Kelly real quick. I know she's keeping track of some stuff. Hey, boot Kelly. her for the team Sean's, please. I, I, we would have to unmod her to boot her. Okay. I will give our passwords to someone, and then you unmod mm, her. No, we won't. And then boot her. Ginger, you don't know our password is a thing. You I can guess that. You could probably rip a couple off and guess them. Yeah. Okay. I got them saved in my Google. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah. I don't know what that is. I'm not a password <laughs> manager. Ginger Geezer. I opened a dusty wallet for once, enjoying a splash of Porta, Kentucky. Love you guys, but I always... Team Cookie and Nux. That's pretty fair, actually, Ginger. That's a fair statement. <sighs> Is that the highest you pay for Elmer T. Lee? Yep, 85? it's the highest I will pay. 80, right? He looked in my eyes. He said 100. I said 80. Immediately, he said, sure. That's exactly how the conversation went. Chris Bradley. What is up, guys? Just cracked open a Weller Full Proof. Yummy. Hopefully, it's a normal one. Weller Full Proof. Dude, even, I'm going to be honest. We kind of like, we kind of, you know, didn't love the store picks. They're all good, though. Wait, wait. I want to see it before you do it. <laughs> Zachary Jones, if you post Team Sean, I pray for you. <laughs> That's one of the best comments that's done in this chat ever since Bill this Bledsoe. channel started. 
watching it on a plane, delayed a bunch, heading to Chicago. Thanks for the entertainment. Are Holy you... shit, when we flew back from Orlando, yeah. Sprint, or, yeah, Spirit, canceled like 200 flights Why? out of Orlando. Why? Don't know. We, I thought the line for security was a mile long. I was like, holy shit, we have an, we're going right. to miss our flight. And all of a sudden, like, I was watching TikTok, and someone was like, yeah, they canceled 200 flights. That was the, the rebooking line that everyone was in. All pain. Oh, it's oh, bad. That would and some me. guy rolled up. It, our flight, well, what time was it? It was 3.52. He goes, hey, I, I, anyone mind if I, I jumped the line a little bit? I got four kids with me. I'm trying to get back home. My flight's at four. Eight minutes. Yeah, buddy. I, we know now. They closed the doors yeah, before that. Hey, they don't care about you. And everyone's like, go ahead. And I was like, we just set that man up for failure. You should have told him, go book. Oh, what a bummer, yeah, dude. Ugh, I hate airlines. Alec? Somebody boo Alec. Ah, he's fine. He Nick, said Team Sean. Geely. About to kill a Bartstown Fusion 5. So happy. Finally available in New York. Are y'all fans or not? We haven't had the Fusion. No, not the new Fusions. Hold on real quick. Because Ryan, he God, said. Tan, I've been tan. No, you have not been tan. You will Sean will be this tan for four days. Yeah. So Ryan said his, it, his last name is N. Alls. N. Alls. Yeah, he's told us that. N. Like, Alls. He's and then told he us that said, like a hundred times. Fuck. Like that. Because we keep mispronouncing it. <laughs> oh. Steven Gills. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate it, Jay. Seem to have found a shirt that fits. Nice. What is happening with Dan? What is... <laughs> Is he talking about you, me, or him? Probably you. You're not wearing like a really tight fitting. This is one. a 2X or some shit. It's like yeah, a it's appropriate. Huge... It's not. It's an XL, but it's like this weird. Ooh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> she got him. Make Zachary Jones a moderate. Right Hell no. Now. Yeah, it's only fair. That's chaos. Hey, we've missed. Have, are we that far back? Are we caught yeah, up? Yeah, we're way back. Are we caught up? Who are we supposed to be uh, asking for? Like, you asked for bottles from someone. I didn't see them tag us and ask. I've I've read through what I believe is to be all the tags. Okay. And I didn't see it. Okay. I didn't see it either. If I missed it, please re-tag us in the five. Yeah. <laughs> Miss not, that. Uh, don't read that one. Uh, Alvin so Morgan, one more entry because I'm starting to get drunk. Thanks, buddy. Cheers, man. Can Sean find Kentucky on yes, that? Yes, it's no, not hard. No, he definitely can't. Someone sent us the shape of Kentucky once. On a, and I, I it had out. it upside down, and you're like, that's Kentucky I upside down. Out. No, you didn't. I picked it out. Okay, no, you didn't. Wow, we're I watched, so far back, people are answering the AL8 question. They clipped it. No. Daniel Middendorf, is tonight the wrestling match? Stabbing match. Julie, I'll drink in Mayor Pingree, 13 years. I'm missing hey. the dumb asses in my house. Come back. All right. The bourbon good. basement. Oh, this must be Wish.com podcast. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> that hurts. That okay, hurts. Hold on. Did you say? <laughs> oh. Fucking boot that guy. <laughs> hey, Bourbon Basement, first off, you're probably in your parents fucking roasted. Second off, if Jerry Black. <laughs> they proofread to ensure it's not a trap. Okay, listen, hold Truth. on. I want to go back to Julie's. It's like a ginger ale. See how it's their burners. Julie, are you guys coming up here later than the year? Or what's the... Ivan Indrelin. The turbo... It's moving on. Okay. Yeah. You're, you're literally singling out two people in this entire right. fucking... Be, that, well, Julie just super chatted, and I want to talk to her. Oh, I hope she stabs you. Julie's on my seat. I have an Angelin. Here. Okay, the white is really hard to read. It I'm is not in gonna the lie. green, yeah. The, the turbo, turbo needs the needs Audi, Audi Z nuts. Audi Z nuts. Upgrade worth it. Audi Z nuts. I don't know. Oh, hold on. Audi. Wait, Audi Z nuts? We're getting closer, I feel like. What do people call it? How do they say it? Audi. Audi? <laughs> Audi needs... Uh, you got to do better. That's a shit one, buddy. Money is an option on the occasion. Whatever you've oh. got for me. Oh, there's Eric's thing. Okay. But I know, but I don't know what you can find is the problem. We don't know what you can go buy. If you can find like a Kentucky Owl or I, that'd be a good one. Yeah. Sai Junior. Which, around. I, you know, good luck, but Sai Junior. Um, King Kentucky. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, like, uh, I don't know, man. What, what can you find, though? I don't know what you can find. Spirit Airlines canceled all flights. We're finally catching up. Pilots went on strike. That makes sense. I think it said 277 flights. I would be out of one airport. Furious. I wonder why they strike. Bad condition or something. It's spirit. What did you think you were getting? We might actually be catching up. Dan, I sent the link to the pen on Discord. All the art today. Team Sean Dan's a bit much for me. That makes sense. Who was that? Don't worry about it. Kick (laughs) him. 
They need a 3XL just to get over that pumpkin head. <laughs> okay. That's very well. William Lolini. Cheers, fellas. I hope Sean doesn't have an awkward crew story to break down Dan's heart tonight. Apparently, uh, newlywed okay. games. Okay. I, I was kind of filled in. Listen, I... Pilots did not go on strike. So what happened? Tell me. Caught up. Uh, Kelly, Alex stole my gold cigar cutter. You need a new one? Tiny sauce flying to Michigan tomorrow to pick up a bottle of Booker's I hid in my mom's basement two years ago. Oh, there you go. What the? I hope you find it, buddy. You just knock on the door. Hey, I need to use your basement. Alex said, I'm going to read this exactly how I put it. After meeting Dan, I'm person. I have no choice to be but to be Team Sean. He's a good person. You're, he has no choice but to be Team Sean. After meeting Dan, I'm person. Yeah, I'm a good person, what he meant to say. He messed a lot of words. Yeah. He meant in person. You're an idiot for not knowing he met in person. No, I, it means we're both good people. You're so You're dumb. A bad person. Oh my gosh. Okay, Alex. <laughs> listen, Alex stole my cutter. Yep. He only gave me these little shit ass Davidoff. He gave you fucking no. Fine well, rare. The whole time I was with Alex, he told me I could only smoke these little Davidoffs that fit in his pocket that are like all filler, <laughs> shitty filler, like they're garbage. Uh, you want to read Masters? Ah, uh, these nuts. Uh, oh, these. Oh, master mustache. Now I get it. Makes sense. That makes way more sense now, dude. Legion, really hoping I get to watch my favorite movie tonight. The Sean Shank Redemption. <laughs> That's a pretty solid name. What's up, Jeffrey Wack? How's it going, buddy? Spirit Airlines had a significant IT issue, which shut them down for an extended period of time. Damn. It was so, a nightmare. So happy not to work in IT at Spirit, Air, Spirit Airlines. Can you imagine that whole business going down and your IT team being like, you know what? We all actually just quit because I'm not fixing it. There's no yeah. way. Too much stress. Uh, so my brother-in-law flew back southwest. They get a free check bag. Okay. So we gave him our bag because he didn't check a bag. It was 52 pounds when we left Ooh, Detroit. Okay. It was 52 pounds when we came back to Detroit. They made him take out two pairs of pants <laughs> and put in his luggage. And I was like, what? Do they know that your bag's going on the same flight? Right. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. What? That just doesn't even make any sense. Cornholio is in the house sipping on some Stag 15. <sighs> I hope you like it, man. I love Stag 15. Uh, more than we thought we did. Stephen Gilly said, do you guys have your own bourbon glass? If not, you should. We were going to do one this winter yeah. with Brandon and Chris, and then we never did it, and we didn't bother Brandon and Chris. Like yep. we, didn't, we didn't come up with a design. And no I, one knows, Colin. No one knows. Anybody got any info on Stag Junior Batch? No one's seen it. No one person. I've not gotten a picture from the person that works there yet about it. And normally I get a picture ahead of time, like before it launches, like at least of the proof or something. Dude, DC's right. Hashtag Aqua Dan. That's one of the bet. Nope, 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 nope. No. I don't trust you. I am fucking. DC's that, a perma. Dude. That is one of the best photoshops. And then the, the gummy Dan. Zachary Jones, oh. don't let me forget off stream to make you a mod. And then you're going to do my dirty work. Then I will stream. unmod you so You fast. won't know. Oh, yeah. He's silently it's doing my I, dirty work. For, okay, click it. Click it for me. That's one more than one, buddy. First time I see. Muted, 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 right. muted. It's like, oh, Zach Jones in here. Zach Jones, I'm going to need you to make Edit. about 10 accounts. They're all mods. I, just I have seen the dickle hound. Yep. That's the new shirt. It's oh, good. I thought you made something new. That's the new one. That is new. I, Has it been launched anywhere? No. My computer. Okay. Our printful <laughs> for a sample. Yeah, that's I, why I saw it. I got a sample on the way. Hopefully it turns out. If it doesn't, then she goes down the hatch. But uh, What's Craig talking about here? Oh, I had a dream I kissed you. Why? Uh, you know, I don't actually know. But I had a dream that I gave you a little peck on the lips. Right on the mouth. I literally, like that. Just once. You know, it wasn't gay. I'm going to pretend. It wasn't it. sexual. Bro, we're allowed to kiss. It wasn't sexual. Yeah. I don't know why I did it, but it wasn't. Here's the thing. Sean Dobbins, so let's change the subject. Long time listener, first time <laughs> caller. Ivan Indolin, mod me. Hashtag trustworthy. Hashtag BJ worthy. Hashtag junkie for I'm life. I'm not modding you. You're not getting modded, Ivan. I earlier said I would open hand slap your face. I did. Hey, throw me another one of these. They're pretty good. No, they all are different. We throw need to keep track of which ones we're one. Yeah, I drank the 16. Throw me a different one with tape. Chop, okay, chop. so you want to, wasn't, wasn't sexual. LMAO said all. This man said I was too much for him, and now he's making a joke about my. Act. Bro, if you can't kiss a guy and not make it no homo, then you're not confident in your own sexuality. Now, 100%. Pants were on. Okay. Shirts were on. 
All right, we're good. For some reason, now this part, and I don't know. You were just feeling in the mood. No, no, no. For some reason, you were sitting right here. And I walked out, and I I leaned over your shoulder like that, and I left. And I don't know why. It was like if we were married. Yeah. And I was like, see you, babe. That would be the kind (laughs) of kiss it was. Oh. But Ricky did then say, I've wondered, like, when I open that door, if I walk out here, if you two are, like, fucking around. (laughs) And I looked at her in her her, her fucking evil eyes, and I said, pinky promise me right now. I explained the pinky promise. Okay. I said, pinky promise? She said, pinky. Oh, wow. I said, you think we're gay? She goes, no. It just crossed my mind that I'm going to push the door (laughs) open, and you guys are going to not have your pants on. Swanee. Drink it, old Forster, bear proof out of the neat glass. Both junkie recommendation, both fantastic. P.S. The likes put the hell of a pregame on tonight. Oh, you said a different name. I was about to go fuck off for a second. <laughs> Wound stretcher, touch and tip to hashtag Ricky Leaks. No, we didn't touch tips. Mastodon, 6 8. We did touch no, lips. 8 9. Polly and Bye for sure. <laughs> yeah, she kept calling me Polly and Bye. Bell Bib DeVoe, $500 super chat. Recreate the Spider Man Mary Jane upside Fucking down kiss in the rain. Deal, dude. I don't even <laughs> You think... gotta be upside down, though. All right. Oh, I'm gonna get crushed. <laughs> oh, yeah, the ceiling's not holding me, I don't think. It's OSB. Tony G, kind of shocked. Dan didn't dream about kissing me. Fair. Tony, 20 minutes ago, you just said I was fat, okay? I mean, it still stands. Kelly said, love is love. See? There you go. Listen. I can't believe, dude, there's, Ricky said some wild shit. Uh, I need to apparently watch that. Bro, I, there was no downtime. There was no downtime between she her and I. She just roasting your ass for two hours straight. There was no downtime. I thought she'd be nervous off the rip. We came, she came in hot. And then she started talking shit about with all the things, about me talking about like I'm famous. She said that. I said I was clearly joking. And then she it brings up specific examples. David Little didn't know Vampires could get a tan. Still Team Sean. So true, David. Hey, will you hand me... Look at that tan. Will you hand me a bottle of water? That got weird. <laughs> like, it didn't have to be, but you made it weird. <laughs> well, you touched my hand. My hand's sweaty, dude. Nervous. The bourbon basement has, at Bourbon Junkie. To be fair, it's my wife's basement, but she gave me a corner. You know what, Hashtag buddy? Chun. Listen, dude. Well done. You know? A, hey, a corner's more than none. Oh, we started in a corner. The corner We, we started in shambles. So. Yeah. Still Are there. You and Sean caught docking. No, we, she didn't catch us docking. Sean Schaefer, favorite old Carter batch style. Rex, if you're buying two, what desirable allocated bourbons are worth secondary price if you live in control state? That's a lot of questions. Okay, hold on. First question favorite old Carter batch and style? Probably a single I, barrel bourbon or from, the American from Railbird. Said. Oh, shit. That yeah. bar- it's the only pick they've ever done. That yeah. single barrel was a pick. They've done other single barrels. Lose but my heart. They were uh, Mark and Sherry's. Yep. So, um, uh, that that rail bird pick is incredible. I really like the American whiskeys a lot. I do too. So I, if I was buying two, I'd probably buy one bourbon, one American. If I was buying two, Ooh, the rye. I would buy any single barrel bourbon I could find, period. Yeah. And then I would buy a batch five rye, I think Yeah, it was. that was one of them. Five? Five is our okay. favorite. Zachary Jones said I'd kiss Dan Sober. And what... What desirable allocated bourbons are worth secondary price if you live in a control state? None of them right now. Someone right, emailed right us. Now it's someone emailed us about thoughts on pricing. And I told them to pass them all. Not one bottle is worth. Yeah, what right now it's so bad. Oh, it was bad. So Booker's thirtieth. You want to guess on that one? Thirtieth. Yeah. Which one was? Is that the one we have? Yeah. It, we, we used to be like okay, so it used to be two hundred to three hundred. Okay. It bumped at the very beginning of COVID. It bumped to four fifty ish. Yeah. Eight hundred. Seven hundred. Jeez, OP. So it's double. It was, uh, that was under the secondary it's price double. someone was going to sell it to him for. I was like, fuck no. Okay, so in front of us, because we haven't said this yet, we do, like mentioned earlier, we do have a bunch of Old Forester President's Choice, and they're different barrels. So one is, uh, I think we have 16, 17, 18, fucking 19. Zachary. Buddy. Who, What's up? Who sent, somebody in chat said, are you finally drinking those Old Forester President's Choice I sent you? It was a soup chat. Who was it? Because these are sitting on the table, and they don't have a name under them. I'm sorry that they don't have a name under them. Oh, I remember reading it. I know. Chats ago. I'm sorry. I hope you're still here. But, so we have four different ones. We love Old Forster Present Choice like a lot. Okay. Like a lot, a lot. So Zachary Jones said, I'd kiss Sean if I were dead. <laughs> Alex Burlock, here's this. Stag Jr. Batch 16. Yeah. Oh, I bet it'll, I'm looking I, forward we to den- it. We hey! deny the docking. Scroll down. No, we don't deny it. It's on our Patreon only site. Like, no, I'm just... You're a power bottom. Yeah, I was on the bottle. That's not docking. 
That was literally docking. Docking is touching tips, You were bro. docked. Oh, it is? Yeah. Okay. You were docked on my ass. Oh, for sure. <laughs> I, I was, like, basically a spacecraft, and you're the 747 taking me up. <laughs> Right. Alex Spurlock, here's a section. I read that. Sorry. It's, it's Dave. Dave. Just Dave. Welcome it's to BJ Dave. Fam. Thank you for Thank the membership. You, Thanks for Appreciate joining, you man. being here. Okay. That's barrel 17 I just poured for you. Uh, Daniel said barrel 23, barrel 99, Railbird, any American whiskey. The Railbird is so good. It's crazy, man. It really is. <laughs> Bourbon Kingdom said it was me. But, buddy, thank you for sending these our way. We love, obviously, you know, but we love President's Choice. For Matt also said it was him, too. He said, I want those samples. He didn't say they were. He sent them. Yeah, he said, me want those samples. Yeah. He said, me sent those samples. I know what you thought. Yeah, I yeah. What is this for? To hang it from something? A belt loop. Oh, okay. Um, so. William Edwards. Dan, how long have you and Sean been together? <laughs> this is why Larry thought 100%. He's like, they're gay. They're uh -huh. gay. Um, Too long. High school, basically. Jorge Rodriguez. For Dan, that's uh, 32 years. <laughs> um, can we get a BJ shirt of cartoon version of you guys <laughs> kissing? Release it next June. Probably wait, not. what's next June? Why next June? Probably not. What, is, wait, is June Pride Month? Probably. June is probably Pride Month, huh? East Coast, liquor reviews. Well, I'm going to guess it. LQ reviews, probably liquor. You think? Probably liquor. Yeah. Hope to have a successful channel like you guys one day. Just brought the... <clears throat> bought the bottle of Redder 22 for 300 the other day. Oh, Ooh, that's a buy. Yeah. That's a buy for me. Um, cause I had, Oh, I think he was the one that was asking in, that's uh, a buy for me. uh, one time YouTube buy. comments. You and he was one. like, would you buy it for 300? I said, one we time. would right now. One Depends time. what it's worth to you. Because here he said, what about lost profit? I said <laughs> immediately. Yeah. So I got to meet when I was on there with Alec and Klein, I got to meet, uh, Ron from Detroit whiskey society. Yep. Who's got a really cool new job, which I won't say on here. Cause I don't know if it's how which public he's me? being, but, I poured the first one. I poured the 16. I poured you the 17. Um, so I met Ron and Alec, and neither of them had had Rhetoric 22 before. And they said, let's get one good pour while we're here. And yep. I look at the shelf. I'm like, if you guys had Rhetoric 22, Ooh. both said no. I'm like, we have to have Rhetoric 22. Yep, it's an experience. Dude, it's so damn good, man. It's just so good. Cheers, gents. It was just part of my first barrel pick at Starlight last weekend. Jerry Hamilton. Oh, Dude, it's a lot of fun Starlight there. Barrel Picks are amazing, man. Like, they're so... Aaron Atkins said, I was proud to have flown the 747, and now I have a whole new image of it. Thanks, Sean. Welcome. Let me turn this shit on. Oh, apparently there's a storm coming. Uh, yeah, Grant says he loves us, us both in the, the most gay way. <laughs> I know you can't read that part. <laughs> Grant Hardwick said that? You had done it. Oh, Grant, what's he, up, Well, buddy? he also said Dan still looks fat and Sean is white as ghost. Okay, hey, Grant, what the hell? <laughs> Grant, you should, Grant's been AFK at work for like a, three months, <sighs> and he stops by and kicks off with Dan's fat and Sean's pale. Hey, that seems right. Uh, Bourbon Kingdom said it was the one who sent the OFPC, but I sent it on my actual name, Zach, Perfect. not my okay. whiskey. Or Thank the you, YouTube buddy, name. for sending these. So, I was like, man, that is not the remember I remember. The one I'm drinking is eight years, old, three, eight years and three months old, 117 proof. They're all different. The one Sean's currently drinking is nine years, four months, 118 proof. <laughs> Dear Lang, next barrel pick sticker. It wasn't sexual, honest. <laughs> uh, so, wait, this is the one I had first, right? Yeah, I, you had 16, so you I poured you 17. 17. Yeah. Uh, 16 is better. Oh, my. Oh, why is 16 so 16 like absolutely way better. heaven. This is phenomenal. Very close on proof, 117, 118. They're both 118. They're both 117, 118. That's what I said, dude. I mean, I read that in red 118. This drink's hotter. Did I pick the one, same one up twice? Idiot. I don't know what you're doing with your life. Did you pour me that or not? Yeah, I, I know I poured you the 17 because you had the 16. Okay. <sighs> Grant said, but I love your face. I mean, I love you too. Uh, Fine. Alex said he hope he didn't offend Ron. Eh. Ron's the nicest guy in the world. Okay. Ron has been talking to us about coming down to one of their meetups forever. Yeah. And he's the nice, and I met him. He's first off, no offense to Ron, way younger than I thought he was going to be. Okay. Somebody yeah, with, you're old. Somebody you get with, that with a lot no, of you. No, somebody with the name Ron, I'm like, you're in your 50s, Swanson. 60s. Right. Yeah. He's probably in his 20s, <laughs> maybe 30s. Literally nicest guy in the world, though. Nick Alec, Shelley on the other hand, asshole. Had a pour of Red <laughs> 22 at a bar a few weeks ago, and it's absolutely thin. It's so freaking good. fantastic. Easily the best ultra age whiskey I've had nope. thus far. The yeah. only whiskey age wise. It's not a sex thing. The only whiskey age wise that blows it out of the water that's super low proof is lost profit. Mm, yeah. Victor's 20 kills it, but I that's high proof. 20, 25. Um, 
Blade and Bow 22 Two. was really good, but I think Rhetoric 22 was, we liked it more, right? Yeah, we, we put Blade and Bow higher, I think. Blade and Bow's also $500. They, some, somebody just bought one for $300. All day. Like, that was three times retail, and they still paid less than Blade and Bow 22. Plus, that Blade and Bow 22's been open wildly less than my Rhetoric 22. True. Very true. Adultish. Watching Bourbon Junkies, playing Destiny, listening to Camp, smoking a blunt, drinking some chat cast. There you go, man. He said pro status. Fucking nailed it, You're dude. You're adult nut to, Enjoy like, the Enjoy your max. nights, man. Okay. A little jealous. <sighs> oh. CJ left his Rat 22 at home. Damn, dude. Shambles. Yep. Lost profit. 650 uh, down the that's street for me. That's, that's around secondary. Yeah. So. Okay. I know because, oh, well, I think he said 600. Because he said, what about lost profit at 300? I was like, oh, yes. all day. Yeah. Instantly. He goes, ah, it's 600. I said, ew. Jeez, man. <laughs> is Lost Monarch Redwood Empire? Lost Monarch is a blend of source whiskeys. It's an American whiskey. It's a burry. Is it sourced is what he's asking. I know. It is. Yeah, yeah. I'm saying it is. It's, yeah. a, it's a blend of source. But... Does Lost Monarch might have their own discipline in it? I can't remember if some of that's their own or not. Going high west at it, just throwing their own in there a little bit at a time. Why not? You know, I, it, hey, if they are, at least they're starting with their Nothing own. Nothing is worth six fifty, man. Man, retail on mixers like twenty five is like yeah, hundred bucks, and, and I would better. pay it. Uh, President's Choice is distillery only for a little bit. Like it's at like one shop locally, but it's otherwise distillery only. Okay, oh, this um, that's so much better. This sixteen is amazing. Yeah, it's so sweet and fruity and light, like on the nose. Did you try that? What's that one? Seventeen. Seventeen. Oh yeah, this is toastier, like oakier. It's uh, it's harsher on the back end. With okay. the, like the oak doesn't mesh as well. The ethanol is like way more. It's more very spiky on the the ethanol. Is it? Like halfway through, you're like, what? Why? I don't remember any President's Choice being like that. So. Hang and AZ said, buy a fridge or a bottle. Fuck that. What if you already have a fridge? I have a fridge. What if you have a fridge that works? Now what are you going to buy? Your only other option was the bottle. You know what I mean? Michael Dow just got a smoke wagon small batch from Bourbon Club. Have you tried? Keep saying Ryan Distiller. No mention of rye anywhere in the bottle. Smoke wagon small batch. Okay, wait. From Bourbon Club. What is Bourbon Club? I don't know what Club? Bourbon Club is. Stanley, the max to pay for bar house right now is probably three hundred bucks. Yeah, because okay. it, because we can't find it, we don't have any. That's Keep the only reason. Keep saying rye on distiller, no mention of rye anywhere in the bottle. I'm very confused. I, Michael, I don't know. Just tag us. You don't have there, to. There's not rye in smoke wagon small batch. Yeah, but there's rye in the mash bill that's in the bourbon. Does yes. That makes sense because it's a rye bourbon. It's just a high rye bourbon. Okay, that might be right. Okay, well, look. I almost bought H. Taylor Tornado the other day. I was Ooh. drunk. Glad I didn't. It was pricey. Can't imagine, Aren't buddy. those like two grand? Buddy, right? So something happened within the past, like, <clears throat> I think six months. All of the E.H. Taylor line, all the old ones, they've all, like, um, like six or seven X'd on secondary prices. What? One E.H. Taylor Sour Mash just went for, like, 20, 30 grand or something like that. What the Some, fuck? Uh, somebody in chat can correct me, I'm sure, but. Sipping. <sighs> On Glen Smashing and Vampire Slayer. Sorry, Sean. I like the Fat Man Whiskey and that Starlight. Funny thing is, I picked the Starlight, too. You guys are welcome. Hey, Starlight or New Riff? Not even close, dude. Just saying. Me and Ryan agreed on that Starlight. Sean didn't. One of the best picks we've done. I feel good about that. Do you? Thus far. Okay. Yellowstone also. Mm -hmm. Yeah, way better. It Sean wasn't. Pick that. <laughs> it wasn't better. Enjoy. Oh shit. Hey, you guys hit the like button real quick while we're hanging out. Six hundred eighty-eight of you guys in here. Just hit that like button. Are we gonna real start quick. a collector's corner? Eventually, Slap you it. Think? Slap the like button. Open. I want to open a couple of those. So no, the answer is no. We open two. We open two of those. Okay. Do collector's corner. So the answer is just no. You can Ooh. just look at me in the eyes and say no right now. Eat me or whatever. <laughs> Aiden said. Sorry, that Starlight -like pig is just okay. Tommy is the fucking Karen of the whiskey community, dude. He's a Karen. You're the first person, Tommy, who hasn't said the finish is awesome because you Karen, buddy, and I love you, and you know I that I love you. I actually think the uh, Wilderness Trail bourbon mm -hmm. is going to be one of people's favorites because it's very different yeah. in a very good I'm way, with you though. Like, that. like, 
it's everything. I think I said it in the video. It's like what I want a store pick to be. Yes. Wild. You said that in the video. I left it good. in. Good. I left it in. Like, do something different. Different experience. Yeah. Right. Tommy, I refuse to take that back. I don't. I'm not taking it back. <laughs> I love you. I, w- I love you, and I won't take it back. Did so- I get drunk and stumble across the countries at Epcot? No. It was too fucking hot. Uh, and they only sell, like, $19 beers. <laughs> Sounds like a steal, dude. What is it? Four ounces? Oh, got him. Got him good. What did he say? What did he he just say? got timed out. No, what did he say? You Nothing. Can, no, if you delete it. That's the, what he said. You take that back. <laughs> oh, wait, how's Tommy? Oh, Tommy's. Did you take Tommy's mod away in this chat? Probably. You're a bad person. Tommy, I gave you mod in here. When? Sean took it away. On the same night you gave Kelly mod, I gave Tommy. Mod. Oh, yeah, I took his away. It was a battle of giving people the mod yeah. that night. I think he got a little. Well, crazy with it. Tommy? Yeah, no, yeah. No. For sure. No, but he would have. That's why you did it. Oh, okay. Yours was proactive. It wasn't I thought reactive. he already was doing it. No, Kelly got wild with it and was accidentally, accidentally. booting people boop, out. Boop, boop, boop. I get 14 messages the next day that half our community has gone. We didn't even say anything for it. crazy. Oh, okay. no, Dan took it away. All right, cool. You'll pay 10K for a turbo, but not 19 for a beer, says Zachary Jones. That is so much more than it cost. <laughs> you get a crazy turbo kit for 10K. Yeah. I mean, that's the 850, and I might have to do built bottom end with it, too. <laughs> so, might as well. Um, Add her on. Sean, did you know we got into the restaurant because Dan is famous? Okay. So, we both have... Blah! This is the problem with, with what's going on. We both have stories, and there was a lot of super chats that we had to get through. Oh, yeah. But I we mean, both, I was going a week. We both have stories, though. You were... I went to... I almost Alec. said some very, Vulgar very things. demeaning things. You're a bad things. person. Yeah. I stopped. I stopped. The, it literally touched the back of your lips. Dude. Oh, yeah. I was ready to let her just eat into this mic. I'm and gonna, the people would be like, wow, my children were sleeping. They woke up, said, Mom, what was that? Now. They're now upset. Goodbye. So I didn't. I just pumped the brakes on that one. Okay. The, the Old Forester President's Choice 16. Maybe one of That's my, a slapper. That might be one of my favorite President's Choices I've had. Okay. I don't remember what yours is. I'm in- very... Interested on this one. Okay. I don't, is that the low proof? 19. 98 proof. How old is it? Eight years, six months. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Nick Shelley, weird comparison, paid 53K for a truck, but wouldn't pay for any whiskey in the world. I caught it by the cork. Wow. I caught it by the cork. Don't do that. Legal Beagle Bourbon said bottle like... Bottle flips for likes. Schwanson Bronson. That's a good name. Say my name. I will. Say my name, say my name. When no one is around you, say baby, ha, ha, ha. Nailed it. If you didn't like the stream before that, now would be a good time. Okay. Is that 19? You're doing 19? Yeah. So 16 crushes 17 for me. Agreed. This I'm going to do 18, which is eight year, three month, 110 proof. Whoever hit this... Whoever disliked the video, there's some, uh, there's some what? legitimately some people in their basements ready. I need for to us get to new drop shorts. Now, oh, this one's damn near red. Holy shit! All right, which one do you think he poisoned? Daniel Mindorf, epic bottle flip. Soon I hear Sean knows nothing of this, so let's not say it. I got a surprise for us, you and I. Why? That's just do. I'm a surprise kind of guy. You know what I mean? No one likes him though when you do it. <sighs> Last one was good. When was the last Copper one? Copper tongue. Yeah, no one liked that. What was the one before that? I did surprise you with Mixers 20 ones. That That's happened. a good surprise. Oh, uh, you did it with the fucking um, Sweetens Cove. I was sitting here smoking a cigar, having a lovely day. Okay, so I'm, You turn on the camera and I said, what are you doing? And then I'm, we filmed the intro with my feet up, smoking a cigar, yeah. and then you slammed down Sweetens Cove. I said, let's fucking do I'm it. I'm one in two. For, like, positive surprise uh, to negative surprise. You coming in as a savant was a surprise. I'm one in three. Uh, you throwing those uh, the, the confetti cannons and sticking confetti? I like that one. I'm two and three. Okay. I'm, oh, my gosh. Oh. It's nice. Take me super home, good. Alabama. That smells incredible, dude. It's West Virginia, first off. Don't disrespect it. Sweet home Alabama. Take me home? Take me home Alabama, dude. No. Take me home West Virginia? Country roads. Oh, shit. West Virginia. Yep, that's my bad. Dan from Oh. Doesn't know. Sean drops the R word, dude. I'm sorry, guys. 
He's going to get us canceled. They know you're mentally handicapped, though. When I say it, it's not a slur. It's the truth. I don't think people go for that anymore. Oh, can't do that? Canceled? Are we big enough to get canceled? Yeah, I would imagine. You... Ugh. I almost said, see, I'm so glad I kept that one into my body. Ugh. There's things that you just hold in and you're happy about. Yeah. Jimmy Durr had my first shot at Malort Sunday. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Tastes like black licorice with soil. Well, and I did get the new OKI Party Source pick. Six-year MGP. Cheers. Hey, I hope it's amazing. Hey, man. I mean, you got. Did you have to take the shot of Malort to get the OKI? Honestly, like, yeah. where are we at with I'd that? I'd do it. I'd do it. Kyle said, good run, guys. Well, <gasps> listen, to, I'm not canceled. Ricky said some shit about me. I'm still not canceled. Yeah. At the beginning, I said, don't say any of the wild shit. And Klein in chat goes, say all the wild <laughs> shit. I think Gulag Supplies is your best pick I've had yet. Really? Branston. Ooh, that's interesting. Okay. Ken Martin, way better. Hey, Sean, was down at Disney for a four-day weekend, too. Wife and I spent the whole weekend just bar hopping Disney Ooh. Springs. Killer bourbon bar down there. Oh. Yeah, that's what Alec told me. That sounds amazing. He goes, go to Disney Springs. Killer cigar bar, great bars. That sounds amazing. We can go. Hey, Trev, Sir Bourbon Wrench himself is here. How you doing, buddy? <laughs> he said the set was blinding tonight. That, I know, and I appreciate him saying that. That barrel 18 is amazing. The barrel 18 slaps the 16, mm. which slaps the 17. Mm -hmm. I haven't tried the 19. These are amazing. We all had President's Choice Batch 12. I could have swore we had, Sean and I had Batch I thought, 11. Okay. I thought that's the one we liked a lot. Favorite Tejas whiskey? Uh, probably the Belmorea. Belmorangi. Nope. Yep. Nope. Yep. Hey, we got a, somebody sent us. Have I shown you this? Mark Torres, this is a gift. Why do people keep sending See that? Me? Limited edition. A limited edition bourbon barrel aged Malort for this BAM 2021. It's bourbon barrel aged Malort. Yep, and it says "bam" on the back of it for real. Because that's your teeth trying to escape your mouth. This small batch of Jepson's Malort was finished in bourbon barrels to be savored by two-fisted drinkers only. That's literally what it says on the back. So, someone on TikTok showed a Malort picture. For they were like, "I love this advertising." It was yeah. Malort. <laughs> These pants aren't gonna shit themselves. Yeah. <sighs> Don't worry, guys. There has been enough pride in this chat to hold off the canceling for the week. We're perfect. There you go. Nailed it. That's true. I told. I said I kissed you. That's true. No, Sean, you were 300 subs short of being famous enough to get canceled. By Dang the way, it. Dan, we're not. That's a, it's a little closer. Than that. <laughs> I don't think you can read the rest of that. By the way, Dan, blah 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 blah. <laughs> you can't read the rest of that. I don't even know what that means. Stanley, can that's how I know you're old because oh, your insult don't, doesn't I make sense to somebody under seven. I'm 70. pretty sure that's what uh, Alec told me to go to is Sosa Cigars. It's down there. Great cigars. Well, she shopped and dropped money for a three ounce pour of Mictor's 25. Oh, I've, I just, how much was it? Ken Erickson. Thanks, buddy, for the super chat. He's uh, Leaf's brother. I'm in New Jersey. And our Russell's 13 release got effed up by the distributor. Oh, they forgot no. to list it as allocated in one store, bought it oh, all. We've been there. Oh, no. We've literally been there. We've actually been there. Birthday bourbon last year in Michigan. That oh, happened. yeah. One guy broke the site and ordered every single one. He got like 75% of them or 80% yep. of the state's allocation. Oh, um, Middendorf. I Alex, had a Wagyu. Alex said, please try it. I have to know how it is. I drank that Malort three times on the stream last week. Why? I said if I got any of the newlywed questions wrong, I'd drink it. I didn't realize how hard newlyweds games are. Did you? Oh, I was supposed to do the, yeah, I was supposed to do the bottle chug, remember? It's not, it's, it apparently Grease and Willer. Grease is sending, sending us something. Grease and Willer sending us yep. something, apparently. Yep. And I can't wait. I'll keep mixing you the worst shots in the world. Uh, I was, never mind. That was a spoiler for Fridays. Team Dan, is Sean going to do the pun? Oh, that's the one you read. You just read uh, oh, Stanley Wagner Jr. said, it, that means I'm a dickhead. Yeah. Uh, did you put that together? Yeah. You really did? Yes. I retract my statement. How else were you supposed to be taking that? Yeah, I was confused. I had no idea. Okay. I thought he was like 90, and old people say crazy shit. You, but you still can't. I don't think you're, we're allowed to just say that. Old people say crazy shit? No, no, no. The, the part that he wrote to call you a dickhead. Like being, just no, calling I'm you, with you on that. Just calling you a dickhead was it. less like, ugh. I needed a ugh. roadmap to figure out what he meant, though. Ugh. Jesus. Okay. Hold on. This is the last one. This it, 18's amazing. It was very expressive. Ah. I like Dan before he was worried about getting canceled. Wait, do you think that I said fuck my mouth on the Friday video? Yeah, you did. 
I love you. You think that I'm super worried? I literally <laughs> said in the other shit I said in the last live stream that I was like, maybe we take it down. <laughs> we've only taken like one stream down ever, I feel. I don't think we've taken I think I did chop a part out, but I didn't take it down. And it wasn't because we were going to get in trouble for saying something wrong. It was just. There was something in there that I don't shit, think you we were guys supposed don't to say know. yet. And we said part of it. Yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. I think you might be right. Okay. The 18? Mm -hmm. The 18's mm. amazing. By far the best. It's amazing. The 18's incredible. Tommy D said, <laughs> Tommy D just came back and said. <laughs> 18, 16, 19, 17. Done. Tommy came back and goes, at Drew Fusenberger, ass hat, because <laughs> he timed him out. Oh, shit. Chris, we have a video going to Whistlepig, buddy, and it was amazing, dude. It was uh, incredible. Yeah. They have great, uh, like, amenities for people. They're super considerate about everything they that you want to do. There, yeah. Anything you want to do. If you just want to sit down on the farm, drink some whiskey or beer. Smoke they had cigars. amazing, awesome beer. This is, the 19 is good, too. Yeah. Um, they supplied us cigars when we said we smoked cigars and stuff like that. They'll take you out. Give like they had a chef for us. They just kept making us great meals. It is fantastic, dude. Any bike rides, lady? No. All the art today said dance so easy to get a reaction out of. Obviously, you're not worried about getting canceled. Okay, Fair. I did. I should have taken into consideration that that was sarcastic. This is too drying. Yeah, the oak is so little, drying. Yeah. So I said. Um, Here's my. Dude, my mouth is so much drier now. Did you go 18, 16, 19, 17? Yes. Yeah, 19, I actually like the flavor on more than 16, but it's finished. the experience is not yeah. as good as 16. And if you learn not to put the mic on your nip, dude, I was editing that video. So Sean basically died on Sunday. Yeah. And so I'm like, we have Oh, Mondays. that could have been what's going on. Because I drank uh, yeah, yeah, and smoked cigar. Yeah, Gabby was right, but for wrong reasons. Yeah. Yeah. And they're like, did you throw up and it looked like this? I was like, yeah. They're like, ah, probably this. You're like, you know what? They're like, good thing you did. Uh -huh. We have an idea now. Yeah. Because otherwise, we didn't. Yeah. So. Um, so Sean was sick on Sunday. And so I'm like, we have a couple Mondays on my computer that we've never put out. Didn't know that. And Just figured I was coming here at 7 o'clock in the like, morning. Not, I, was, shooting I was like, and you editing. just went to the most COVID-ridden state in the fucking country. Do not come to my house after you Warm fucking mask, do. Warm mask, sanitizer all the time. Just drink it. Yeah, pretty much. I'll get it out of there. <laughs> Um, but so I start editing the video and I'm like, why is it so scratchy? The audio is so scratchy. And I'm like, oh shit, we had to be wearing the lav mics. And yeah. then when in the video, when I take off my hoodie and it's literally on my nipple, I'm like, what were we doing? I never found yours. I don't even know where yours was at. I have no clue. It's clipped underneath my shirt. I was wearing a, like a hoodie. Here? Yeah. Dude, it was the worst. Yeah. We were I the put worst. it in between the pecs. We were so bad at this. Oh yeah. Uh, any news on Penelope batch plan? So... There's a bunch of news. Yeah. It was in State of the Junkies. I didn't do State of the Junkies this week. It was in the last State of the Junkies. There's more, but there's news since that. We're going to toast a bunch we're, of it. But we're going ahead with what you pretty much said. But we're they toasting. don't know any of that. You know that. Can and I, I know can that. Can I tell them that? Yeah. Hey, we're toasting my blend because it was good. We like Sean's blend the most. Fantastic. Uh, that was the first blend I came up with after learning the new rules of blending. Yep. Um, so we're toasting a barrel char three. Char two. Mm. Two? Doing char two barrel. Gonna throw her in, let it age up for a couple weeks, and then start doing weekly tastings on it until we're like, that's it. And then that'll go out, and that'll be a full barrel. Full barrel. Big old full one. Like 200. It depends on leaking and angel share, but it's not in the barrel for that long. Yeah. Should be about 200. Why are you saying nice job, Sean? Blend it a winner. Oh, on the blend? Yeah. Okay, fair. I thought he was like, you laid all this out. And I'm like, motherfucker, No, dude. for blending the winner, okay, obviously. Fair. I did my part. I'll give you that. Okay? Mm, okay? I did my part on it. Okay. Blended a winner. You blended mediocrity and would have went with it. Just saying. I wouldn't have went with it. I turned mine down. Yeah. If I, okay, no, 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 no. If I was willing <laughs> to go with mediocrity, we would have went with my, your, like, third one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Garrett Buffington. Hey, guys, heads up. I'm in Michigan also and was able to snag a Weller foolproof nice, from the man. Kroger. Nice. Got a call from the manager to come get it, but still, keep an eye out. Um, okay, Kroger. You probably are south of us by quite a bit because yeah. I know they sell liquor in Kroger's there. Yeah, the one by uh, my in-laws sell it. Yeah. They just started. Yep. 
Although I think a lot of the Krogers down there sell liquor. And, and they like do them, picks and stuff, none too. None of them up here do. Yeah. We don't they get, don't care up here. We don't get liquor Kroger. So, yeah, that's, that's happening. And then we're getting um, new vatted blends sent to us, new samples that we're going to do some more blends. If they don't beat my original blend, we'll go ahead and just barrel my blend or bottle my blend. I don't, I don't, I just barreling it like we're toasting that one too. Oh, fuck you. Or we come up with a new blend and that gets bottled and going up. The idea is we come up with a new blend. Sean stays toasted. Then we do a very large batch of the new blend and we keep Sean's toasted. Basically, it's going to be a barrel. It'll be like 200 ish bottles. So. Oh, I don't know how many pull ups Ricky can do. Buddy, I, I think I could still maybe buddy, take her. It's. Is it real? It's unfortunately a biological disadvantage. Yeah, for I think I can still take her. Listen, Sean's frame might be feminine, but he's still some portion of like, still? like the genealogy or whatever is male for Sean. So, all right, genetically, I said genealogy. I sure, think that works. No, you know, I'll let you have it. Um, I think gene- genealogy is a better word. Nope. Okay. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, Sean can do more pull-ups than I can. And I can do more pull-ups than Ricky. So. I gotta beat two. It's for like, you, listen, so. pull ups for women are a different. That's a different game. Unfo- not all women, but a lot of women. And I know this because Ricky's been working her ass off to do pull ups. That's why I say that. Should we ever get into it? I wanna open at least one bottle. No, I'm gonna <laughs> fucking kill you. <laughs> yeah. I was hoping you'd forget. We're the one, we gotta open at least one. All right, here, let me get I'm that never, for you. Because I've never had this. Not even sharp. That's the dullest blade I have ever seen. Okay. So the problem is you're not holding it still. It's okay. Stop cutting it. Watch. Let me show you a real knife, dude. Let me show you. Watch this. Ready? Watch this. Oh, fuck you. Look at that. <laughs> I'm just gonna hold my hand Boom! Up like that. Vero engineering, bitch. That's a new commercial for them. <laughs> you guys can have it for free. Actually, just send me a Vero. Um. Listen. If they send you another shitty one like that for that sound bite, it's probably worth it for them. <laughs> I just want to dump this on you, dude. My sister could do 36 pull-ups in high school. She was a competitive water skier. A lot of upper body strength and ski- mm-hmm. in water, uh, like wakeboarding, water skiing, all that kind of stuff for sure. Um, <laughs> Genealogy is about your ancestors. Genetics <laughs> are about your gene makeup. Dan, do you even science my guy? <laughs> you know, sometimes. Any new tats soon? Yeah. I was lining one up this weekend. Straight. No, you're not. I guess I was. I swear to God. Probably the day you... Buddy, I'm getting face tats. We're getting eyelid <laughs> tats. We're getting the whole thing. I'm getting... What does uh, Post Malone have? Always tired under his eyes. So All right. Yeah. I'm going to get more around the tattoo that's on my forearm. Um, oh, you showed me that dick's tattoo. I didn't think you were going to put that there. <laughs> that's weird, man. So... Don't shit on Benchmade. I'm not. Sean's knives are really dull because he can't sharpen them. Definitely not the issue. So listen, let's first talk this about... This smells like shit. <sighs> I'm going to break this bottle over your stupid face. I have never had... This bottle's not even for you. I don't care what you think about it. This is Valley Tan. Barrel select... <coughs> Nailed it! <laughs> what if that would have broke the glass? What if that was one of our 50K glasses? You just broke it. I know a guy. Um, okay, so... This is a High West Valley Tan Barrel Select, number 17926. That's a lot. I want to give you a stroke for that. Utah's whiskey are not to whiskey originally produced by the Mormon Pioneers, made from a blend of wheat and oat whiskeys. I have never, ever had... In that comment. That is one of the less attractive... Ugh, would you pin that up there? It's also literally one of the best made... Vero <laughs> So shut your fucking mouth. Uh, Mashville, so the next pick by Sean should be called Stab Jr. <laughs> there you go. If we ever get a Stab Jr. pick, you know. Talk, you guys talked to Sadrack about that. So this is, they said no. this is their, I believe, to be their own distillate. This was sent by Livewire Whiskey and Will, Will and Michelle Davilar, too. There's a bunch Ooh. of people involved in getting this here. I've never had a Valley Tan before. Mark Redding from Texas gave me a Valley Tan because I never had it. And it broke. The TSA freaking broke it. So uh, No, what they did was open the bag it was packed in, take everything out, slam it back in, give it the people's elbow from the top turnbuckle, 
drop kick it across the tarmac, oh. throw it back into a fucking plane, and they're like, here's your shit. So this is a blend of wheat and oat whiskeys, which, mind you, we've never had an oat whiskey we like. For, aged from three to six years. The blend is wheat whiskey, 90% wheat, 10% malted wheat. Oh. And the oat whiskey is 85% oat, 15% malted barley. There's a particular blend that's been aged in a white port barrel for one year, six months. It's 97.2 proof. I don't okay. know what a white port is. I've never even heard of that. I assume it's wine. I th- well, I thought port wine was, like, usually red. It is. So I don't know what a white port that's is. That's why I'm assuming it's still wine, but I don't know. Okay. It's really weird. Whoa. It's funky. That smells like the pears from the fruit cocktail jar. jar. I can't smell shit because that fan is pushed over here. I think you farted. I don't know. I didn't fart. The right. fan's not even hitting you. Um, yes, it is. Put your hand right there. I can feel it right here. Yeah, so it's hitting Oh, it's me. coming under the, it's under the table. That's why. Yeah. It's not above, idiot. Yeah, it's right there. I Sean's a dumb dumb. Wait for it. Port wine made without the skins. Huh. Okay. Is that real? The grape skins? I'll take your word for it, because I don't know. Do you ever say I'm dirty, Dan? No. Nope. Nope. I just say Dan's dirty. Nope. Like, physically dirty. He needs to shower. Um, so that's why I was late tonight. Because you had the shower? Um, because we went to... So Holden had flag football after work. Fair. Okay. And they're in the playoffs. So if they win, they move on. Like, tonight. Like, if they win, they play another game right away. They win, they play another game right away. So, they win a game, and then literally the second game came down to the last play on the one-yard line. It was crazy. Anyways, they lost. Anyways. Did they throw the ball instead of running it? No, they ran. They went full Patriots, No, no, huh? they, it, it ended on the one-yard line. <laughs> oh, that was Seahawks, sorry. I think that's been a lot of teams now. No, the Seahawks, when yeah, they had Marshawn, Marshawn Lynch, Lynch. didn't run it, yeah. They threw this the guy ball. named Beast Mode on the two-yard line, they're like, you know what? Really throw them for a loop. We'll throw it. <laughs> yeah. Um, but they're, they're cutting a hole in our house, and they're putting a patio door right there. Yep. They cut the hole today. Okay. He comes out here, and he goes, there's an electrical. Oh, the brick? Yeah. Okay. The hole's there. They, they You're going to have a raccoon they problem all, No, they had it all always beat up and stuff. Raccoon. Until the door goes in. So anyways, they cut the hole, they, and there's electrical running through the wall, and they're like, hey, I'm pretty sure the electrical, it, it seems like, they're not the people who put the electrical there. So it seems like it goes to out here. Mm-hmm. So... Let us know when you get a set because we have to cut that line. I'm like, okay, cool. Because they got to run it above the door now. So <laughs> I do everything. They cut the line, and I'm like, I, I didn't lose power. We're good. He's like, all right, cool. We get home. We leave before they left tonight. We get home from football. I'm like, I'm going to take a shower because it's 80 somehow. I've been sweating the whole time. Yep. I turn the sink on, no water. That line was for our well pump and our lift station for nice. our septic. Nice. So I call him. And I'm like, hey, just so you know, we don't have any water. So, like, tomorrow, just hook it back up. He's like, I'm on my way over. I'm like, you literally don't have to. It's like 7 or 8 o'clock at night. Like, if you don't have running water, though. For a night. They show up at 8 in the morning. Yeah. So what are we going to do? We both work remote. Okay. You know what I'm saying? It's not the end of the world. What water are you going to drink, Dan? Like, there, you don't even have any there's drinking There's a whole water. case of water out here. So, anyway. So, I'm like, you don't have to. And he's like, no, no, I'm coming over. So, he came over and hooked it back up. Took a shower. Had to run into town, though. So. Colt 45 said, $5 toward Dan Tyson face tap. There you go. Hell yeah, dude. Ooh, a whole Toshi also island? said, I'm a Pats fan, and yes. I was at that Super Bowl. Yep. Only one I've ever been to was fucking unreal. I bet that's crazy. Yeah. Okay, at a, as a worse story, Toshi, I was at the game where Aaron Rodgers threw that insane Hail Mary against the Detroit Lions for, like, the beat last part ass. of the game to beat the Lions. And all the Lions, all the Packers fans... Or, or all the Lions fans were leaving, and then he threw that pass. Everybody was pissed because it was in Detroit. It's not as cool as your Super Bowl story. I just wanted to tell you that because it was fun. Yeah, the Lions don't even know what that is. The Super Bowl? Yeah. <laughs> they don't know what the playoffs are at this point. It tastes very malty. Miss Wrench is drunk on wine. Looked up Halloween outfits for us and our dog. Someone send help, said Trey. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think that. Is it the, is it the oat? Is the oat coming through a lot? Yeah. That is funky as shit. It ta- I like it makes it taste like faux dusty almost. The oats do. It's weird. You have no, ex- no idea how excited I was when they didn't give the ball to Marshawn Lynch and they didn't score a touchdown. I was so excited. I love the Patriots. They put me in, Coach. They could have picked me Marshawn, up and thrown me Marshawn over Lynch the fucking defensive 100% line. 100% of the time, score a touchdown. Mm-hmm. Like, 
You put the whole line in just Marshawn Lynch and a quarterback in the center. Marshawn Lynch gets. He's gonna break his back and three people that he fucking hit. One of the most dominant running backs in his time, and you're like, take a seat, buddy. We got this. (laughs) Don't even even line up, bro. What? Oh, just left field. Start picking daisies. (sighs) Okay. (sighs) This okay. This tastes drastically better than I expected. If I'm being completely honest, because the 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 marriage of the blend. Do you think it's maybe it's the finish though that cleans it up? Maybe. Hides that oat. I, I get, so I know what you're talking about. I also get that if you open a can of fruit cocktail, not the syrup, none of it. Only the white, the pear in mm-hmm. there. Mm-hmm. Only the pear. I get that. Is it like, it's like a weird hot pineapple or something. It feels very like single malty. Mm. Or maybe like. It does. That's what it feels like a craft single malt. Yeah. You're right. I wonder that we have the high west um high country American single malt. I bet it this is sweeter. Cause I'm starting to get more of like the chocolate in the back end a little bit. Yeah. And there's a ton of malt flavor. Mm-hmm. For sure. It's gotta be the oat. No, I well there's also that wheat'll do it too. Well also that was 100% wheat, wasn't it? Twenty five percent of the mash bill is malted. Malt yeah. malted something. So Don't love it, don't hate it. Did Sean eat anything while he was gone, says Harry Jones? Dude, we ate so much. We were averaging 20,000 steps a day in the Florida heat. At one point in time, I ate my meal before everyone else. My brother-in-law said, I've never seen you eat so fast. I said, I was hungry. We hungry, cuz. Little Sean, eating his little foods. Oh, it's so good, too. It was, the, uh, sorry, go ahead. it was like a Thai dish. Ooh. So it was uh, rice noodles with, it was like a chicken. So good. And it was spicy and I ate it. I didn't care. Very hungry. I like this. No, but I, I, I think this is one of the whiskeys that I have to know what this is. That's I think fair. if you blind me with this and I'm thinking bourbon, it's gonna, I'm going to say some shit. So it's basically Irish for you. Or even American single malts. That's fair. It's so funky, and I think what you what you and I often go when we, you and I blind stuff wasn't off the kid menu. You and I often think it's going to be bourbon, just because that's what we drink the most. So I think realistically, if you if we blinded this, I think it would fuck us up. Yeah, and inevitably, it's going to go on the shelf. It could go on a Friday, so we'll see. <sighs> what part of Florida were you? The part with Disney in it. Yeah. Drew, I don't know why that was fun for me, but I. <laughs> I appreciate you asking that question. So the Orlando area. Burai is good, Brian. The new ones are good. I can't be yeah. the only one who stereotyped Sean's the chicken nugget and mac and cheese, bro. Sean will eat that shit, Taco Bell, the rest of his life. Sean's blood is thicker than mine. It's not. He's just framed smaller. No, I had a lot of tests done recently. They told me I was very healthy. They did not tell you were very. They no. told Sean his liver was fine. Yeah. Sean drinks more than I do. Not true. A hundred We got done shooting yesterday. Yeah. You drank a beer. You literally told me one day beers don't count. That's where <laughs> you're at, dude. One day I said, I haven't drank for four days. You're like, yeah, I didn't drink for the last two. I'm like, nothing. You're like, just a few Bud Lights, dude. <laughs> Those count. don't count. Hell no. <laughs> Dan, next fix sticker needs to be with you and Ricky and a Love Boat logo. Oh, wait, does Jefferson's Oceans do picks? I think Hashtag they do. on a cruise. Don't Jefferson's Oceans, or do they just do their other ones as I- picks? No, they no, do. No, they do Ocean's because picks. that well, that one weeded one that we had was a pick. Oh, I don't like them, or else that'd be a really fun giveaway. Collectors' corners. I don't know. Dan lied right to my Give fucking away, face yeah. and 30, said we're gonna do a collectors' minutes, corners tonight. No, this was Sean's idea to do the collectors. I also knew we haven't fucking streamed in two weeks, and we had a bunch of shit to do. Maybe we'll do like two collections. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I put on the thumb. I put question mark. Collectors' Scott corner. Question said mark. Beers don't count. Beers don't count. Well, Sean is talking light beer, and I w- I poured a light beer. So get and if I have one with do. dinner, that's not that's not even drinking. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Never, never <laughs> look at my stupid eyeballs stutter and say that's not drinking. That's Ever. not drinking. That's a hundred percent. Oh my gosh, dude. Mm, nah, that's not drinking there. Uh, okay, so do you want to talk about anything about your trip on here? I'm going to tell them people about Detroit. It's hot. 
Okay. I walked a lot. I feel like you and I should have just been weathermen, dude. <laughs> every video, every trip you and I take, everywhere we go, it has something we to do with weather. We got dumped on one day. Oh. Like, so bad. It rained so much. Everyone in uh, Disney knew to have a poncho, though. The Except thing. you guys. No, we had ponchos. Oh, okay. Oh, for sure we had ponchos. Uh, her dad carried a backpack that was like the Inspector Gadget backpack. Had everything. You're like, can I get? He's like, yes, I have that. His dad had your Mary Poppins purse on his back. Oh yeah, everything. It was a lot of fun. I liked uh, the the old Tower of Terror, which you did not like. I, that one makes me really sick. These the guy in front of me was losing his shit. It's not, Made it fun for me. It's not that it's super. It's not the scare. It's, it's the, the up and the it's down the sickness. Yeah. Not COVID. It's motion sickness. Yeah. I dr- ate a lot of Dramamine. Good there. That's fair. I did drink a good amount of beer, so. I don't blame you on the Dramamine. Yeah. The beers help. Is that your story? Uh, I, I'm just giving, I want you to have your time. That's all I got. Okay. Um, it was fun. So, I don't, we're not, I'm not telling you guys about the whole Detroit story. I'm not. Oh, why not? I went to Detroit. I went, stopped at A&B, met a couple of people that I had. He sucks on dicks. Yvonne from, Yvonne from A&B. Listen, the guys from A&B, if you guys ever drive through Michigan, people send messages on Instagram and stuff a lot. If you're driving through Michigan and you need places to stop, A&B Liquor in the Flint or Detroit area, Opperman's in the Tri-City area, like Midland, Saginaw, Bay City. Um, See, that's a different one. I've not had that. It's a sour. Um, so you got the variety fun pack. I guess they're all different. Yeah. All four. I drank three. <laughs> Thanks for leaving me the sour, Dan. Well, you told me you took four. You told me you took them home. I didn't realize you took two four packs of the stouts home. Yeah, me either. Obviously. <laughs> Okay, but anyway, stop Bourbon there. Bourbon Junkies A chapter coming soon. <laughs> yeah, like three to five years. Not for, dude. I, I did not buy a lightsaber. You want to? You should have bought a lightsaber. Oh, yeah. Quick guess. At quick, Disney? Quick math. You're in Disney. I will tell Are you. Are they like pretty cool lightsabers? Oh, yeah. They're like really? glass and they like. Oh, okay. They're okay. really cool. I will tell you. Let's just throw this out there. Uh, Mickey button up, 130 bucks. Now. T-shirt? Uh, yeah. Button up tee. Oh, back me 100, the bucks. fuck out, dude. There's a Pirates of the Caribbean one as 170 as a t-shirt. N- no, that was what? only 150 I'm sorry. Why? It's a shirt. Tim Norris and Sean come back to Orlando, and I'll give you a drinking tour around Epcot. Oh. Wait, do you work at Disney? Hold on. Maybe, maybe he just lives there and has like a, because they, they, the season pass holders just got to go back like recently. Um... Heard Dan likes cucumbers, said Grant. Okay, so anyways, I went A&B because I always stop at A&B when I'm going out to Detroit. So I stopped at A&B. I tasted a bunch of their store picks, bought a really, really good Nulu toasted rye pick that I really love a lot from them. Oh, you were supposed to guess the what? price of the lightsaber. Oh, yeah. Fuck. A shirt's 130 Oh, yeah. They gave me a Minimum, voucher. Minimum, I'm saying 275 300 right? Oh, it's 300 On a lightsaber. Yep. And Very if you cool smash one. it into another lightsaber, yeah, they die. it's exploding. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, dude. Yep. Oh, shit. Uh, I got a soda spilled on me at one of the restaurants, and the lady gave me a voucher for shorts and socks. And that one pair of socks and pair of khaki shorts came out to $70. Oh, my gosh, dude. They are killing it right now. Yep, I totally geek out on Star Wars World and use my children as an excuse to go there, said Scott. It was a really cool area. I like that and the Pandora area a lot. Resident annual passes are 15K. <coughs> that can't be right. 15K. For resident. That's people who live in Florida. That can't be real. Oh. oh. Maybe they really upped it. Spencer sells different colored lightsabers. They vibrate and that's- everything, said Robert. You get it? $15,000? No, that's like the one that you can go to any Disney worldwide is the $15,000 ones. There's no way. Because we, we have, um, well, Gabby's family has family that lives down there, and it, it's not that much for them. Tim said, I live here and wife works for Disney. Missed opportunity. Okay, but he's not the one that says it's 15000 No, no, he's the one that said, I'll hit, hit me up about Epcot. Bro, I was there. I, you got to post that shit on Instagram. Yeah, log into the Instagram. I don't know the password, by the way. I literally don't. Okay, know Kyle password. said, I have passes. They're $65 a month. Resident passes are only six. Okay, I thought they were $750. 600 ish That's yeah. actually not that so bad. So the $15,000 ones are literally you can go to any Disney in the world. So you don't go to Paris. Apparently, everyone hates that one. Also, hey, but you here's the anyway. thing. If you're buying a Disney pass for the whole world, you're already balling out of control. 
Yeah. Because you can afford to go to Disney's around the world. Yep. You know what I mean? Like multiple times too. So now, yeah. So if you ever leave the the program for having yeah. it, like you can't ever get it back. Oh, it's like Ferrari. Oh, they they track the car, you in they there. Tell you yeah. You can't have it again. Yep. Okay. So I did love Canada. Oh, what does this Epcot. mean? What does this mean? They have like the countries oh, around yeah, the yeah, world. Right. It's really good. What was good? Uh, I went there and got a Michigan cider from Canada. It was hot. Okay, so you didn't love Canada. You loved Mike Michigan. Franklin. Thanks for the entertainment. In Canada. Yeah. It's I a like cool how Canada's like, yeah, they're basically us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah fuck we'll it. take it. Canada probably makes shit ass alcohol, anyways. No <laughs> offense. Lot 40. Oh, that stuff's actually really so good. So much fucking My Alberta bad. rye. <laughs> Okay, you guys make good rice. Okay. I'm going to stop there, though. <laughs> That's fair. Um, well, they can't make bourbon. <laughs> so, so, Canada has the best Disney restaurant. It's a steakhouse. Really interesting. Both would know. Both knows everything about restaurants and that shit. He's got a terrible palate for food, but Dimitri said rude. I would imagine Dimitri's <laughs> from Canada. My bad. Hey, we live in Michigan. We're basically Canada, dude. Canadian, yeah. So, um, what I want to say was, so I stopped at a and Drink the new little book. <laughs> drink a bunch of store picks and stuff. Brad Smith, I can't read that. That's funny. Oh my gosh, bro. Um. Anyways, Ugh. I meet Alec down at this place called Godfather's. <laughs> Best wings I've ever had in my entire life, without a doubt, dude. <laughs> Zach Jones, pin that comment. Um, I can't. So, Godfather's. If you ever are in Detroit, uh, you got to Google where the A and Bs are in Detroit. I have no idea. I, I got there's three A and Bs and ones so in Flint. Two of them are south of that one. So, Shel- one's in Shelby, I think, Township, but we can try that. What is it? Bartstown French Oak? French Oak. All right. Where's the box? It's over there. It says the person's name on it that it's from. Over. Where's the box? It's right below you. Is it Literally. the box? It's the box that's open, yeah. Two boxes that are open. What's the little? It's the big one. This didn't come in the gigantic <laughs> that, fucking they box. They really fucked up on that shipping. Has ever seen Sean Paul box to death before? Oh, it's wrote on there. I was looking on this stick. Oh, we're dumb. Uh, Travis Neary. Travis, Travis sent this. Okay. So, this is uh, Bart's on French Oak. <laughs> 105 proof. So, anyways, yeah. The, yeah listen, a polite pig. I need to know that. All the A and B's are great. But, I went to, we met God, Alec at Godfather, Klein and I. And then we ate the best wings I've literally ever had my entire life. <laughs> and thanks, bud. I don't. You've interrupted me so times. I sub, <laughs> so many times. I subconsciously didn't pour you That's whiskey. Dark. It's very dark. It's wine finish. French oak. It's French oak finish. French oak is oak, bud. That's not wine. <laughs> Let me just. Uh... <laughs> Sean does interrupt me a lot. I know, Alec. Thank you. I have to. No, I'm trying to tell the story so I can get out of the fucking way. Go ahead, bud. So I mean, I go to Godfather. Sean and I will go to Godfather 100 percent and eat food there because it's the best wings I've ever had in my life, hands down, without a doubt. I don't care what anybody says. I guarantee I'm right. Klein confirmed that they were the best wings he's ever had. Also, they have a monster cigar selection, insane cigar selection. And foot through that box. <laughs> then we went to Churchill's, which is, the fuck was that, bro? Whoa, you know when that tingly, something just walks across your fingers? Yeah, I interrupt you all the time. Yeah, so like, that spider. I didn't say a word. That was you're, a spider. You're talking about me moving a box. They were not boneless. Fuck a boneless wing, dude. These are traditional. These are legit amazing wings. Derek, you guys got to try that Nulu maple syrup sometime? Damn. So anyways, we're full on boonies. I mean, kind of. Um, so we went to Church Hills, which is like a steakhouse cigar bar. You can smoke in both these places. Mm-hmm. We go to Church Hills. This is what I want to get to. This is the only part of Detroit I'm going to talk about. We're sitting at the restaurant. We're having a wildly inappropriate conversation. Okay. About vegetables. Yep. And uh, I explained that I didn't know the difference between cucumbers and pickles for a long time. I learned that within the past five years, right? And Fucking rough, so we start talking about cucumbers and pickles. And I'm not going deeper into that part of the conversation. I go out to talk on the phone to my mother. And I come back in. The tables are the table's clear. We ordered dinner. Haven't yet received it yet. I sit down in my chair and the waiter walks up behind me and goes, hey, I have your uh, dinner here. And so I move out of the way and I'm like, he's got one plate. There's, there's literally six of us at this table. If one plate of food, like why the hell did you bring my dinner? He sets it down and I swear to God, it's a 12 inch cucumber with two 
dollops of whipped cream on the base Balls. and one dollop on the tip. Head. With chocolate fudge dressing. You know what I mean? I don't know. There's Excuse. cucumbers and shit all over the place. I have a picture on my phone, but I can't show it to you guys because we don't have it on the computer. So I can put it on the computer. Alec the computer. literally ordered a cucumber dick to the table. I know. The waiter literally looks at him and goes, I'm going to have to charge you for a full cucumber. And he, Alec goes, all right. And no, I didn't eat it. I hate cucumbers. I refuse to eat them. Now, Alec did. Alec and Klein ate the cucumber. So. He sent so a flattering up. photo of you. Oh, I picked up one of the balls and I shoved it. In oh, my yeah. Mouth. It looks like you got balls in your I mouth did. right I there. I literally picked up a whole, with my hand, whipped cream ball and put it in my mouth. That looks so bright. Oh, yeah. Damn, the balls. Do you have any more? Hold on. Leave it on that. Balls yeah. deep. But no, in leave there. it on that one because okay. Brian sent me a. There it is. Oh, yeah. Does that have Klein's number on it? I hope so. There's the cucumber. Little curve, too, you know? Serve the curve, as they say. You served it. But, needless to say. Right in your mouth. That was my experience in Detroit. Got home at 3 something in the morning. The Toastar is great. Also, was surprised to see my patron, Ward Glenn, arrive just in time for it to you. Thanks, guys. Oh, yeah. Glad to man. Are you good? That's that was my story. story. So we're going to run the giveaway in uh, at 11. It's 1043 right now. The giveaway is going to run at 11. Hot math. What? Do 17. Math? So good at this, huh? Better than you thought. Let's put it that mm. way. I figured you'd say 27 if I'm being honest. <laughs> Have a few cigars. Romeo E. Juliet, 1875. Nat Sherman, Hamilton, Natural Acid Cigars. Gold, Rocky Patel, 50. Given that anything, Alec Bradley, you can recommend. <sighs> the problem is I don't know, like, I don't know the Two acid that a lot of the Romeo and Juliet's are like in the middle of the spectrum or on the lighter end. Yeah. Go like, dude, you know what? You can always go with the Lancero coil always. Yeah. That goes with that. Coil, everything. Lancero or a Tempest natural yep. always. In the Corona. Tempest start, natural Corona. Start on those two, man. And then go from there. Kintsugis are awesome. Oh, you hey. It's Anthony. He said that's one hell of a shirt. Oh yeah, dude. I was like, that looks familiar. Alex said I'm crying right now. Alex thinks he's the funniest person a lot. Do I like? I don't like any cucumbers. I eat, I like pickles. I hate cucumbers. Sherry, aka Sergeant Flying High. Hey, cheers. Cheers. Thank you. Um, but yeah. So tonight's giveaway. If you just got here, there's like literally we're doing seven or nine. Literally. Yeah, I don't know how many more dick stories he was. I got no more tell. dick stories. We sure. got coffee to give away. We got aged or neat glass. That's uh the bourbon junkies one that's gonna come out in a couple months with frosted glens, frosted KBT, gold inlay on it. Frosted Glens. We have a High Camp 375 Copper Flask. Which is fantastic. Bunch of stuff. That's what we're giving away. All right. So, we got to talk about the sponsor tonight. Because <laughs> we have it. And they just dropped something new. So, we should talk about it. Hey. Not because I love it too, but because I really want to give Google more money. So, Liberty Not License. Well, we appreciate it either, you know, no matter what your reason is. So, thank you. Boom. I was going to say, I got cigars around here somewhere. Hope you guys are having a great evening. Thanks, David. Appreciate it, buddy. Bo Tillman, today is my lucky day to lose my 13th or give or take 20. Live stream giveaways in a row. Have some more money. Thanks for the super chat, buddy. Four ninety nine to get into the giveaway for all that stuff. Oh, Four ninety nine or not. You had one of these in your... Yeah, for Tellos. Yeah, you have it? You like was, it? Um, a lot of people like them. Okay. A lot of people like for Tellos. I've only had one of the Fratellos. I wasn't a huge fan. Finally found a Magic Tell's very nice. Went with the bullet pick I was lucky enough to get. Oh, dude. Magic. I just asked Alec today for some Magic Toast because we don't have any and I miss them. Coffee, dude. Having a, have a Magic Toast with coffee change your life. I need to win that flask because of hunting in high tree stands. There you oh, go. it's fantastic. It's so good. For I that travel time. with mine a lot. Big Vic. Cheers, guys. Thanks for my BJ. So you had to Thank talk you, about the giveaway the and then talk about the sponsor right, at the same time? I know. Well, it's my bad. I didn't, you know, I didn't really think about it. Like that? Um, yeah. Uh, every five gets you one entry into the giveaway. Julian Jaman. I could live in the nose of the Starlight Pick forever. I, I love you for that. I think that's AKA, why people are going to like the Wilderness Trail. I agree. Tommy, a.k.a. Karen. Um, you say Karen? Karen. Tommy's a Karen? I thought you said you were going to put that inside. Tommy's the one messaging me, by yeah, the yeah, way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I, you, correct me if I'm wrong, chat. I think like an hour ago, Dan was like, you know what? I'm going to take care of that so it's not going to be making that noise all oh, night. Oh, that pen? Refine.com. Not sponsored. R E F Y N E dot com. Great pen, much cheaper than a lot of other ones. For cucumber wangs. 
Tommy said, hurry up. I can't speed up time, Tommy. I, mean, I can't, buddy. Speed up your actions. In 11 minutes. In you 13 minutes. want to talk about Cigarclub.com is our sponsor for this fine evening, as you've seen on the screen all Thank night. You. Listen, Cigarclub.com is something we got to talk about this. It's, it is on the screen. Thank they God. put out customs every other month. Other month. I was going to say two months. Same thing, but. Yep. Every other month. They, I swear to God, the customs, you get five. I think you can, I know you can do we, five. I don't know if you can do 10 on the customs or not. I don't know that. The either. customs is the fucking subscription without a doubt. To get from for Cigar sure. Club. Now, that's if you just want to sign up for one. Yep. Cigarclub.com. Bourbon Junkie 30 get you 30% off your first bourbon. Bourbon Junkie tw- BJ20. It's not 30? BJ, not Bourbon Junkie. BJ20. We changed that? <laughs> but he's never changed. It's been that every, it's literally since we started. BJ20 will get you 20% off your first shipment of Cigar customs? Club Customs. So, if, hey, if you put Bourbon Junkie 30 in there, I don't know what happens. You can try it. <laughs> so, <laughs> fucking put 90 in there. Um, if you want normal Cigar Club, their subscription service, cigarclub.com is a subscription service where you get to actually provide them feedback on the cigars they send you, and they'll take care of you in your next pack. So, you say, I don't like this cigar. I do like this cigar. You're going to get more like the ones you like, less like the ones you don't like. You get to custom tailor your cigars. So, it's very easy. Dan figured it out. It's super easy. There's a QR code. You point your phone. And add it, and it literally just pulls up. You click the little link, pulls up your cigars they sent you. It's perfect. Yep. Now, that all being said, use Bourbon Junkies. You got me all fucked up, dude. Use Bourbon Junkies 30. No, I'm just use Bourbon Junkies. Holy shit, you got me all fucked up. I've never messed this up. Use uh-huh. Bourbon Junkies 30 at checkout on the normal Cigar Club subscription uh-huh. and get you 30% off your first month. Yep. That's probably what you're thinking. Probably. Um, but they, they just did a the, new custom. Yeah, the, the teleprompt was wrong. It, it, it told yeah. me the wrong line. Yeah, that's it. You'll read, <laughs> Sean will read thing. anything on there. Fucking thing. Um, but, yes, yeah, so they just launched a new custom, like, now. So now's a great time to sign up for the customs. Yep. There have been two or three, cust- three customs so far, and they've all been right. absolute Bangers. hitters. Without a doubt. Like, they've all been some of my favorite custom ones. I usually get one I've had. out of the five that the hut gets. The, we each get our own fiver. No, we don't. I just smoke nine. Yeah, that yeah, makes sense. Yeah, listen. Um, but I we're supposed I think we're gonna be doing a pairing coming up here on the new custom that's coming out. So if you grab some, you can join us in the when the pairing video comes out, it'll be like a Saturday video. So thank you for yes. cigarclub.com working with the channel as always. Listen. And we got new goodies coming out soon with them. Yeah, we're working on a cigar club box with them right now, like a BJ box. A, <laughs> in theory. Yeah. Been waiting to say it. <laughs> <laughs> in theory. But yeah, so we're working on a box with them. We're working on a bunch of stuff with them. It's going to be awesome. Uh, they're going to run, they're going to host our next uh, Bourbon Junkie Cigar, too. Yes. So it'll go through their site. Which has been rolled, right? It's in production. Okay, sure. Eric Thompson, more than just a label change in the old Forester 1920, the product inside is so much better than what it was before. That's what Matt said, Eric. Oh, That's why I want to try it. It was good before. Like, it's not like it was bad. Oh, Breeze is in here. No. Happy We're birthday to you. Do you think he's like, Happy does it start with a five yet? Do you. What? you think his age starts with a five? Happy birthday, Grace. Happy birthday to you. Nailed it. I nailed that. You know, did Madonna? He didn't say, uh, damn singing gives me a boner. Now, <laughs> Jillian Jimenez, also just waiting oh. on the animal call soundboard. <laughs> Bryce, we all know Dan learned that all he knows from Ricky. Hashtag team savant behind the savant. That's pretty fair. Hey, yeah. I will say on the couch tonight, I looked at her, I said, clean up the Fridays now. Do better. Pour better Fridays. That's what I said to her. She goes, I just pour the whiskey. I don't, I don't, you're not. She has no idea what she's pouring. It's great. Well, I said, I need you to hit me up with some. Cheats, yeah. Baseball signs here. Scott Tilden. Well, I'm just sticking with the 15th tonight. Just finished the cabinet now on Sam Houston. I think we'll be lights out after that. Like, you are lights or you're just going to bed? Bro, I've muted this phone four Bad times. And Tommy, Tommy D is so strong that it won't even mute his message. Tristan M, yes, $5 or $4.99 if on uh, Apple. Yeah, dude, you, you got one of those dumb Apple products. Jeff Brown. Red Got stick. a bottle of Stag Junior batch drifting yes. from a birthday. Hard to find, Amazing. but well worth it. Cheers, guys. Hashtag Team Sean. Obviously. You agree with a lot there. Red stick. I love everything there except Team Sean. He said obviously. Just because you guys are a 
Addicting as whiskey. I didn't think that's what it said, dude. My brain went to a different place. Where'd you go? Nick, a dick. And then it just stopped. It literally just stopped. Good. Um, Nicholas Jones said it. You, if you miss your cucumber, you could just smoke a Texas Lancero. I saw that. I was on the phone out today. He goes, hey, what do you guys need? I'm like, actually, we need like a few things that we don't have. And he goes, you guys need Texas Lanceros? I'm like, throw a bunch of those and a bunch of Maxes in there, dude. Uh, those things are all, all, all giant cigars. We still have like every single one he's ever sent us. We in cut one once, yeah. The, well, I lit a Texas Lancero for a picture yeah. on Instagram once. And I smoked about this much of it. And I'm like, I'm going to die. <laughs> I'm going to die. Jam Singleton. Call me crazy, but I like the same Houston 14 more than okay. the 15. The Oak Profile and the Texas O2 back to the 15 isn't well integrated as the 14. See, that could be a very batch dependent thing. Okay. Because we it like could. our 15 really a lot could. more than all the 14s we Matt, have. spoiler alert, Matthew Porter just put the same Houston 15 a very high in his best whiskeys of the year so far. Yeah. So. Mobile won't let me do five. It Even, does, Tristan. Hopefully, this counts for an entry. You yeah. got an iPhone, huh? Sorry. Yeah. Love a good box of BJ's, said Grease. Ooh. Fair. Okay. I think we all <laughs> do, buddy. Uh, East Coast LQ reviews. Any new bottles you guys are looking for? The new Parks Heritage announced. Oh, not excited. Heavy char wheat. Oh, I should be excited. We have liked every heavy char. No, no, no. Because it'll be super expensive. Yeah. I love every high end weed. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Every high end weed. I should love this one. Yeah. Shit. I just got it. Very excited. Nicholas Jones. I get that 10 oh, pack. Okay, cool, and they're perfect. amazing. Haven't oh, yeah. had one I don't like. Okay, yeah, so there you go. You do do 10 packs to the customs then. Is Seven KO minutes. Batch 4 worth the $100 jump for Batch 3? I have the Batch 3 and love it, but it's just because oh, no. the last batch is genuinely better. Oh, it's it's, not, I don't think it's better. It's not worth it. I no, think it's here's the thing. on par yes. with what 3 was. Yep. I don't think it's better. Yep. Unfortunately, they, they, they just hiked it because it's the last batch. Klein and I both went back to Alec's hotel. Actually, Alec came back to Klein's hotel room, and so did I, Liberty Not Licensed. Just Wesley K, peace from Toledo. Love those whiskey drinking boys from up the road. Dan sucks. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck, Wesley? You literally said love them boys and then said one of us suck, dude. Uh, now we're catching up. Dan singing gives me a boner. Mm-hmm. I'll mute you. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff. Kizaya. Do you oh, guys enjoy like rock star Tatuaje? Right there. Easily my favorite brand right Tatuaje. now. PS Vampire Slayer pick was amazing. You didn't get mine. Great That's why. job, Jeff. He got both for sure. Um, uh, hey, Tim you Evans were drinking said, a little Vampire Slayer the other night. It was yeah, so good. I it made threw you puke. Up. Yeah, I threw <laughs> up the next day. So it makes sense. <laughs> oh, shit. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. What? Tatuaje. Put this towards the new teleprompter. Thank you, Doug. We should get a teleprompter. That'd be fun. We just type each other shit on it. We should put it on the wheel of punishment. You have to say whatever's on it. We can't get each other canceled. That's not mutually <laughs> beneficial. <laughs> Andy S for a big bag of cucumbers. Oh, my. Nope. Oh, the shit that almost just came out of my mouth would have ruined my life. I need you to stop. No, it wasn't. It wasn't actually inappropriate. Bomb burgers for 125. Now, let me tell you that we put at 95 blind. It's close. Go butter. I don't probably see if, wouldn't see if they'll do, do it. it for I wouldn't do it. You're way behind. Nope. Belinda Giff. Great what entertainment is- as usual. Why what? did, hold on. Why did Grease say, Grease text me. Grease said, I can't talk about it, but I'm proud of you. Are you talking to somebody else in chat? No, he's talking to us. Why? Bro, I was so lost <laughs> for a second. Ah, uh, you guys. Secret in. time. Secret <laughs> time. Brought to you by Road Podcaster. Robert. Negrande. For the drawing, Cucumber Lover. <clears throat> Adam. <laughs> okay, bro. I literally considered picking it up and just shoving it in there. For the, for the Fun one, for the I grew up in Lebanon County, PA, not far from Schaeferstown, where the original Mictors was and cannot confirm or deny being a teen liberating juice from the shutdown facility before FBI locked it down. <laughs> That's awesome. Bro, uh, that was the best roundabout I've ever had. <laughs> like, the way that you went about saying what you just said was absolutely Here you go, fantastic. this one's for you. Make Dan say, uh, na 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 Is that that? Uh... It's a dick, dick. I know it's a dick, dick, dude. Yeah, it's a dick, dick. It's two, a couple one-two eggplants. Yeah, it's one-two eggplant. Same Houston 15 right now. Oh, it's the best bourbon out with Old Force. No, it's not. I was reading Elmer T. Lee for two ninety-nine. dollars uh, no. for the rest of your life, dude. $300 bottle of fucking six-year whiskey. Holy shit. The parents are speaking in code again. Mm. 
Yeah, that's how you uh, don't know what you're getting for Christmas, kids. I can't wait until somebody in chat goes, yeah, I can read lips. Anyways, they said this, canceled. It's no, I, I went like shit. this. I put my mic in front of me. Yeah, I know. They can make it up. People in chat will just believe them. Oh, that's You true. see what I'm saying? They don't even have to be right. That's fine. This community, toxic, hateful people. And I experienced that last week. No. They're all Team Ricky. No, no, there's a difference. No, they're all Team Ricky. All hateful. Every one of you guys. They're not hateful. They hate you. There's a difference. <laughs> Do you not know that? <laughs> That's actually pretty fair. The segment of Burm Junkies brought to you by Marcel Marceau. What does that mean? Why did I read it? I don't know. Let's see what it looks like when the bigger BJ. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Zach. Liberty not licensed. Hey, you can go fuck yourself, okay? Because you said when the bigger BJ drinks <laughs> an entire bottle. Oh, That's you. You're the worst, dude. I, I choose this one. Who the F is paying 300 for ETL and 400 <laughs> for 400 for four? I choose that one. You got to stroke that counter at least three <laughs> times. I said the same three words three times in a <laughs> row and kept going. Oh, my God. Oh, Marcel Massieu was a mime. Was he French? <laughs> Break your franchise. Steve Damron said drinking Vampire Slayer and smoking You're damn right, bro. CC Customs right now. I'm Suck happy, it, Sean. I'm happy so many of you great are wrong. people. Yeah. I, I was only calling some people. He that, fucking honey dicked you with the worst pick. You're welcome. <laughs> it wasn't our worst. You drank it the other night. Yeah, and it's worse you than my pick. You chose it. And it's worse More than crushable. my pick. It's worse. More crushable. Than, so I wanted something More that would just crushable. Eh crushable. with the Fuck Wagyu. You, bro. You're such a Zach, piece of shit. I'm going to call you Pillager. No, it's secret, pilger, secret, dude, like no, pilgrim. No, pillager. Pilgrim. Secrets, secrets are no fun. Secrets, cucumbers, hunt someone. Hurt someone. I read hunt someone. Yeah, this is hurt. What am I up to? Oh, buddy, it's not a good one. Nine. That's it. Yeah. You're up to six. You suck. Okay. Your crowd is predominantly male that likes attractive women. Yeah, I know, but here's have you guys never just been around attractive women without being fucking assholes? Jared O'Connor <laughs> hoping to win for once for some reason. Very excited for a whiskey advent calendar are season. You? Best time of the We're year. We're not doing one. Yeah, we are. We're not doing Don't one. fucking lie to these people. We're not doing one. We got to figure out a different David way to Roll, do it. David Roll, more of Dan's bottle flips. Dude, we're doing it the same way. No, we're not. Viewer submitted. Nope. What's the, what are we betting this year? We bet a bottle of birthday bourbon last year. I clapped your shit, so. Fucking yeah, bet me, dude. whatever you want, because you're losing this year. You <laughs> fell off. It's not going well for me, huh? <laughs> Spoiler I Ricky, alert. I go, I got COVID, like half COVID. I have like the symptoms. I'm of- not Googling the log, David Carr. <laughs> Wait, hold on. What does it say? You think those Lanceros are rough? Google the log. Remember when we were at the tribe event two years ago? That man had a cigar that was like literally. I just, a, I just saw that picture because I had backed up my phone. Sure. The other day I was like, holy fuck. That was a literally two foot cigar. C. Naff said, Jets. Cheats. Jets. You ran two E's in a row and went Jets. with, eh, huh? Uh, English language knows no bounds of when it wants to fuck up. True. I can Colonel. read that however I want. It's not a real word, therefore I can read it however Colonel. I want. When yeah. do. Have we had our bank scotch too? Jimmy, yes, we have, buddy. Love it. Was that a Got a lot of it. What did you say? Have we had Ardbeg scotch? Why do you say it sounded like you got Jimmy? kicked in the nuts? Oh, there was a it. lot going on right here. Okay. It made its way out. <clears throat> Jonathan, good stream tonight. Here's to losing another raffle. <laughs> <laughs> Kelly said last call. Last call. Uh, One is- minute. Oh. Eric Thompson. Dan said the cucumber was huge yet for him. It ended up being bite-sized. Tony G, don't we a need a toast for the legendary coach Bobby Bowden. Even if you aren't a Knowles fan, he was one of the best no to ever idea do who it. That is, but cheers. Cheers. I hope I at now I, I just hope that was a made up name. Yeah. And it, we read something we weren't supposed to. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> oh yeah, that would have been a good one because we would yeah have we both just choosed it. it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, would you make a Glen with the rabbit on it? No one likes that. Ooh, that would be cool. We'd have to take off some of the small detail, but that would be cool. No, Sean has hair. That's why it's better. Sean has what? Better hair. Sean does have better hair. Duh. I haven't had my hair cut since before COVID. No, you've had a cut. No, I haven't. Not by a professional ever. Sean goes to a barber. Yeah. I've cut my hair for over a year and a half now. Yeah, I don't know why. And you know what? Could be worse. Saved lots of money. Has 
No. I've saved at least $100 okay. in a year and a half. Sport clips, what, 20 bucks? I'm not going to sport clips so they can jack up my shit worse than I can. <laughs> okay. Dude, you go to sport clips? This, that's where you're here. Zip. Oh. Temp in the shed, 75, even 65% humidity. Holden. Stephen Moore, thanks, buddy. All right, we're doing it. Are you guys ready? We can tell. Somebody boot <laughs> Zachary Jones on the chat. Somebody boot him. You know what? You're it. not getting mod next stream, Zachary Jones. You can, you're not getting anything, dude. First time was the best. You remember how bad the first time was? You wore a beanie. I shaved my head, literally. You wore a beanie I shaved for the a sides month for real. the video. Legit basically. shaved. At a zero guard. So. Uh, any, easy. Not a football fan. I was any football. I'm a huge football fan. Not college, though. Who watches college football? You know what I mean? Oh, aren't they going to start paying college athletes now? They're allowing college athletes to receive money but they're not paying them, but they can receive money from sponsorships. sponsorships. So, and they can receive money for, um, who's that motherfucker that just left Clemson? No idea. Uh, I don't watch college football at uh, all. He didn't lose like a single fucking game. Tim Tebow. Nope. Okay. He's Reggie replacing, Bush. he's replacing Tim Tebow. Reggie Bush. Someone tell me he would have made a fucking killing name. Image likeness is what they can get paid for now. College football is more entertaining. No, it's not. It's a bunch of people who aren't as good as people in the NFL playing yep, the same Trevor game. Lawrence. There you go. Would have made a boatload of money. So would Tim Tebow have. Yeah. That man would have made Johnny a Johnny Manziel. ton of money. Peyton Manning, apparently. They, yeah. they did a bunch of, um, somehow they figured out, like, who was the most popular. Oh, yeah. Because it's, it's name, image, and likeness because they sell their jerseys and shit. Well, they're and in like Madden the, games. Yeah, and or the NCAA school just games. fucking makes that money. Yeah. It's like, hey, you're selling my jersey. Yeah. Motherfuckers. And, and giving me a probably a relatively shit education. Oh, yeah. yeah. It, uh, it, it's basically a communication major. Yeah, it could be. Yeah. Um, okay. Listen, the college football is a bunch of people who aren't quite good enough to make it to the NFL, right? But you get to watch They're them children. play slower plays. I don't, I'm not saying they should be all, you know, I'm, like, I'm not giving them shit. They're far more athletic than anybody I know. Hey, Dimitri. Super Dan, bulkstimulants.com. Jeez, oh, Pete, what? See your cardiologist first, though. Swollen rip BJ. That's literally steroids. That's why he just linked Bro, you that's Dimitri. that's a real thing. steroid site. Thank you sure. for the membership. Appreciate being here. <laughs> Thank you. Bama's freshman quarterback already has seven figures. Good for him, man. That's what, dude, good for him. That makes me feel so a milli, happy, milli, man. Milli, good milli. Because fuck the NCAA. You know what I mean? Pieces of shit, I swear to God. Jeb said, used to get cut every two weeks, that's so much. Haven't had a haircut since May 2020. The mop is real. So many bottles were funded by the whole haircut. Hundreds of dollars now. Uh, we need Kelly to tell us our numbers, and then we'll pick it. Kelly. Mm -hmm. Please choose number one through 252. How many do we have to do? Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. Shit. It was at least seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight. I think I said nine. What was the ninth thing? Two, four, six, eight. Do eight. I can see eight things I said we were going to give away. Jonathan Hyunch. Hey, fellas, just bought two bottles of Old Forcer President's Choice Cheezo Pete's a few weeks back. And it's our first time buying a bottle of that expensive. Really happy about it. They're really good, man. That's probably like one of our second favorites that we had of the lineup. Yeah, it's really good. Uh, Dimitri N, I can now use this. Need team cookie. And Sean, thank you. Okay, don't put the team Sean in there. Dimitri. Here you go. Eight. One, the, what was our number? 252. Nine is the sour. What's that mean? 252. Oh, the beer. You're saying we were going to shoot No, we're not, we're not sending the beer somewhere. This is to me winning. Thanks, buddy. Ready? Yeah. 69. Of course. Uh, 200 even. 41. Mm, 178. Are you going to write them down now? Yeah. Which ones did you do? 178. Yep. 200 even. You got four to go. All right, 252. I was going to do one, and now I can't. Yeah, you can. It's the opposite. Uh, I'm going to do seven. One more. 
You got one more too. We each got one more. Oh, ba -ba -ba -da -ba -doo. I'm going to go with 14. 82. Okay. I have all these written down, Kelly, if that was too fast. Kelly, thank you for keeping track for us. Appreciate you. Blue people. Grease is 69. Cheated again. Grease was in here for 69. Hell of a fucking uh, collector's corner we did tonight. Oh, do one while we wait. Just do one while we wait. <gasps> I want to talk about something I've learned, but I don't want you to make it boring. Because it's science related. Oh, no. Eight giveaways, Kelly. Yeah. Go ahead. There were, I could have swore there were nine. One, two, three, four, five, six. Go ahead. Seven, eight. Man. Um, okay. What remedial thing did you learn recently? No, no, no. It's so intense. Okay. Time crystals. Go ahead. Do you know what they are? I, go ahead. Do you know what they are? No, I guess not. So intense, bro. Okay. I'm not going to explain it to you correctly. I bet. Listen, if you, you'll read up on it, okay. and then you'll be like, there's literally no possible way Dan could have described these correctly. Yeah, I'm going to guess that. It's a new phase of matter that's been discovered by Google's quantum computer. Okay. Like, in the past week. Okay. So I guess there's been, like, people working on this for a long time. This is a theory. Physicists had this theory that was We real. got our fifth state of matter? Yes. Okay. And they found it. But it's, it's fucking nuts. It's theorized. In quantum, um, in quantum mechanics, it exists, not in reality. Exactly. So they, they, okay. they can actually now recreate it. In, this is the first time they've ever been able to create it and recreate it. Okay. A in, quantum event that they're recreating? In quantum mechanics. Okay. It completely ignores the second law of thermodynamics. Okay. And it, it, expends no, right. it expends no energy while moving. Newton would not enjoy that. Right. Yeah. This is why it's such a big deal. It's because yeah. it's fucking everything up. But Google's like, we figured it out, dude. But yeah, needless to say, I don't have a lot to of say about it. Because I don't want to like confuse everybody with misinformation. Yeah. It's super intense. It's very hard <laughs> to understand. Titus nailed it. Dan, time control. Sean, fuck my life. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hold on. Let's see who won these. I'm going to write them down next to the numbers. So, oh, man. I can't <laughs> wait till Dan talks about how he learned men and dinosaurs didn't exist at the same you know time. The, you know the difference what? between men and dinosaurs? Like, do you know the age gap? 10,000? Um, Is it way more? It's so much more. <laughs> Damn it, dude. Oh. 65 million years. What? <laughs> Billion? 60 <laughs> 10,000? <laughs> Oh, 65 minutes. shit, dude. Okay, hold on. I missed <laughs> Alex's chat. Alec. Hey. Add two ashtrays to the giveaway. We need two more numbers. <gasps> uh, Can we show uh, them? the new one? The new ashtray. Dude, the new ashtray is fucking hitter. Kelly, we need two more. Alec, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Alec, I'm telling Sean about time crystals, okay? <laughs> Fuck, man. Pick two more numbers. Um, Kelly, I'm going to write them down so you can worry about them. In I'm going to do 100 even. And then I'm going to pick 31. We didn't pick that. Perfect. What was the head thing? That for? was me mixing up the numbers in my head. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. Number seven, Zach Pilger. You guys have to email us at Bourbon Junkies. Nope, bourbon, no, bourbon junk, junk at gmail.com. Bourbon junk. I've never matched that up before. Bourbon junk at gmail. <laughs> Shut the fuck up so they can hear me. Bourbon junk at gmail.com. Cheech is going to put What's it in your the address? chat. What's your address? You got, I know, but nobody knows that. And nobody reads chat. They're just going to ignore it and not email us. 14, embellished podcast. 41. Who's that? Tommy D. Who? Tommy D. Tommy one. Tommy's getting shit in the 69, bottle. Jason Dirkoat. T U R C O T. I know how to spell Turka, dude. Okay, 82 Elephant and Orgyan. Hey, I said I liked that name earlier. Orgyan's got two E's in it. Apparently, there are seven states of matter. You're an idiot. 
You said four. Well, I know the first four that he listed. I didn't know the. I've the never even quark. heard of the shit that's at the end of that. Gluon statement. plasma, the Bose Einstein con- condensate, and fermomic, fermonic, must be from Fermi, uh, condensate. Okay. Did they name the eighth? Time crystals. It'll be crystals. Apparently, except. 178 Julie like. Already wrote that. Okay. 200 Liberty Not License. 252, Jeff Gazia. You're it's K I Z Z I A H. Okay, I would have not guessed that because you pronounced it like it had a G in it. Gazia. <laughs> 100 Jorge? Rodriguez? Well, where'd you see that? Oh, and 31 is DC. Oh, nope, not sending him <laughs> Send shit. It. DC ain't getting garbage, dude. I won't even send that man Send shit. It. I won't drink. Wait, <laughs> Land of the Lost wasn't real. Where did the slee stacks fit in the dinosaur human timeline? All right, so here's who won tonight. They didn't. Jason Turcotte, Liberty Not Licensed, Tommy D, Julie L, Jeff Kazia, Zach Pilger, Embellished Podcast, Elephant in Oregon, Jorge Rodriguez in D.C. If you won, you have to email us at bourbonjunk at gmail.com with your address and the, just that's it. And the fact that you won, I'm going to keep this. I wrote this. I wrote your names down. I'm going to keep it. Cause then when people like Alec email me and say they won with their address, I don't accidentally. Send I hit them this something. so hard. I reset it. <laughs> <laughs> Dude. How about I didn't have a single stroke, like explaining a very basic concept of time crystals to you. Okay. Pretty you, impressive. Let's not throw quantum mechanics and basic in there. No, I said, I explained it basic in a basic manner. Isn't it? You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Here's what you said. If we've sent they, our addresses before, do we need to send it again? Will you just yes. do it to help? It'll. It, I, it, listen, I got to go through and make sure I like check all these off. And if yeah. you send it, then I just delete your email when I send it to you, and it makes it easier for me. <clears throat> Eric, it's completely random. She randomizes the list, so when we call like one and two fifty two, it's it's completely random. Yeah, she um, randomizes all the entries. That's why yeah. there's two hundred fifty two entries. That's why. That's why we just. Rip random numbers yeah. and it means nothing. We yeah. we don't keep track of anyone's. Well, if stuff. you're the last person to donate, it won't matter because after she randomizes it, it'll be a random person was the last number two fifty two. Yeah, that's how randomization works. Grant said, since I have not been here in the past month, give away. What do you want to say to me? You want to say something to me? He said, give away another, give away, give another away, and it will be a sample of every pick y'all came out with. Holy shit. Kelly, are you still here? He if can't so, do can that. we pick one more number? He can't do that. We got like four picks that haven't even come out yet. He said that he said that y'all have come out with. Yeah. So that's fair. We have stuff that's come out. It's not come out. It's you come out. You just said it. We haven't come out with it. No, we picked it. Right? They've come out. No. That we picked it. <laughs> no. Okay. And here's what you said, by the way. What? They've named a new state of matter. That's true. Time crystals. Yes. You didn't explain anything. They did. They don't use any energy when they move. They, take two, they move between two states. It's always the same two states. They move between two states, mm-hmm. and they don't consume energy when they do that. I told you they, they don't yeah. follow the law of thermodynamics. I told yeah. you lots of things that yeah. are basic. That's fair. I don't, listen, my understanding is not for, for all right. Kelly said, sure. Kelly, I'm sorry, and thank you. Okay, pick one more number. Uh, this person gets the samples from Grant. 123. A nice little one, two, three. What was it? I already wrote it down. Relax. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's just super. So um, jokes on you, Zachary Jones. I didn't buy Skyward Sword uh, being, yet. Being super general about it. No time. They're basically explaining like if you put six coins in a box and you shook it a million times, whatever. Yep. 100,000, whatever. You shake that box. Yep. You get these random outcomes every time every you time, open the box, yep, right? That's quantum mechanics. So the thing is, this time crystal was showing that actually when they were, they did the same thing. They put the coins in the box in yep. theory. Yep. And then they shake the box. And they know every time now exactly what the outcome is. Mm. Every time. Mm-mm. Yes, they do. Mm-mm. Buddy, they've done it over and over. Mm-hmm. They've been, they've had this running for months now. And they can, they literally said now every, they found out now that every time in, it's an even stop, so if it stops at 100 or 1,000 or whatever, 500, mm-hmm. if it's an even stop, they know the exact outcome. And if it's an odd stop, they know the exact outcome. And the outcome... We live in a fucking major. goddamn simulation then. Yep. Yeah. In the, in the outcome in which it's odd, it's different, 
but it's always the same. As it's different than the even, but it's always the same as the odd. No. So one, three, five. Be. Buddy, I'm they discovered this. Nah. All right, man. Read it up. Nah. <laughs> so Google thinks that now they can create time crystals with this. In in quantum mechanics. Yeah. Not in, you know, yeah. our live, like normal situation. Yeah. Wild shit. So they're saying Wild based off a, a number of bounces or whatever. Any number they can tell you now. So how are they just mixing it up by bouncing or whatever? Yeah. There's your shaking the box. One shake, two shakes, three shakes. Okay. And every time, now no matter what the number is, even on, they can tell you the outcome. It's what they found. For infinite number of shakes. They said, they, they, they were like, we did it to 1,000. We could tell you. All 1,000, okay. right? Did it to 100,000. Could tell you. Did it to a million. Could tell. Like, literally infinite. It never broke. They could tell the exact outcome of opening the box, what the coins, where they were, and what was up on mm. each coin. Oh, and guess. on top of that, it consumed the coins moving somehow. Now I don't know how they figure this. I'm not listen. I'm not the guy to fucking explain this to you. Yeah. They the the coins use no energy in moving. This is the other part that's weird as fuck. It's the only thing, the only time they found something that moves that costs nothing. Dude, it's fucking crazy, man. No thanks. It's I'm gonna have to read this, dude. You when you read it, you're gonna be like, it still doesn't make any fucking sense. <laughs> They literally said when the things, there's two states of matter in these scenarios. There's only two. And every time they switch, there's no energy cost. Yeah. No oscillate, energy not state. move. Yeah. Yeah, whatever. You get the fucking gist, David. So they're changing. I'm trying to explain quantum mechanics right now. Relax. Yeah. They're, they're changing outcome states, basically. Yep. Yeah. With zero energy. Yeah. I, it doesn't make, I listen, I'm not saying it makes sense. I'm just saying they found it. They did the thing. Mm. And Google apparently has the largest quantum computing yes. engine in the world apparently yes. so that's why google's doing it they also like they they broke a bunch of records and shit for quantum uh computing when they built that okay yeah <laughs> two I guys drinking s- bourbon d- debating mind <laughs> earlier both literally said dan knows more about time crystals than he does about fifth grade fifth grade geography <laughs> oh for sure <laughs> But, dude, it's because I kept reading, like, I read one article, like, it was, like, a clickbait, like, Google fucking changed the world type shit, right? Yeah. So I read it, and I'm like, I don't understand anything that just said. So I started looking into it, and then my brain went, stop. You have to stop. We're going to explode any moment now. There's not enough fish oil in the fucking cabinet to there's get through smoke. this. smoke. Just, there's fish oil dripping out of <laughs> my ears. Did the viewership just drop off? Probably. Why not? The giveaway's over. We didn't do a collector's corner because of Sean. You know, here we are. I'm sorry, chat. Hey, did Kelly say who won because we weren't paying attention? We scroll up. Oh, I mean, we got four ninety nine. I don't know what we got. Kelly, Kelly, wait, scroll Kelly. down. I saw her name. Kelly, she's, blue. she's got a blue one. Okay, up. I I was up. gonna say I didn't see her up. name. Up. She or, usually tags us when she does it. Kelly. Is, oh, Are you serious? Christ. It was Zach Jones. <laughs> He's only got like one of the picks or two of the picks too. He That's deserves none. Perfect. Zach, Zachary Jones won the pe- the pick kit from Grant Hartley. <laughs> Adam, Dan explains quantum mechanics, doesn't understand the difference between poisonous and venomous. <laughs> Listen, I man. Blame our schools. Because this is what happens when there's something that's interesting. Uh, Listen, I'll never fully understand quantum mechanics and time crystals. Like, that's not the goal. I'm supposed to probably be able to understand venomous and poisonous. But one of those isn't interesting. And one of those is more <laughs> interesting. So one of them is... You know, life saving. Not really. Yeah. I'm gonna go to the doctor. And I'm gonna say I got bit by a snake. I'm not gonna have to say it was poisonous or venomous. <laughs> I'm just gonna be like it was a big motherfucker and she rattled. <laughs> like, what did it sound like? <laughs> like that, and then it sounded like fuck me screaming. Oh, I forgot about this. So we went to Florida. Yeah. We went to Sarasota first. I don't know what that is. Is that uh, like wine country? No, it's uh, it's like it's further down. It's like two hours south of Orlando. Known for their beaches and stuff. Okay. Really great. They got red <laughs> tide going on. I'm sorry. Grant said, Grant, or Zach said, Grant, keep the Glen smashing pick. He's never had that one, by the way. I know that for a fact. Anyways, go ahead. <laughs> 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 Motherfucker. They have red tide going on. What's that? Uh, that so, like a disaster to me. Yeah. It, so, like, we, we roll up to the beach, right? Okay. Oh, yep. It smells horrendous. Yeah, I know what this is now. Now that you say the beach. Um, there are dead fish all across I've seen it. pictures just of this. everywhere. It's so bad. 
And I was like, I'm not getting in the water. Fuck no. Like the things that live in the water are, are dead. dying out of the water. And then there's like families playing in the water. I'm like, what are you doing? Why are they doing Kids that? Swimming in. That's it not. Shit. Don't do that. And then I started reading it, and they're like, Ah, yeah, we're looking up because it like it acts as a neurotoxin, and that's how it kills the fish. And they're like finding out that it's like long term effect is not good for the people living there. Shot. Hey, can't believe that. Yeah. Like you said, all the things that literally are made to live. Jared, in go for the fourth. <clears throat> What the fuck is that? <laughs> you lifting a lot lately, bro? I blow my elbow there, dude. I have to do some physical therapy tomorrow. <laughs> Hold on, we gotta try this. This is a dab. I don't want it. Fuck. I need to move this paper before I ruin it. There's whiskey in it now. Okay. Uh, uh. This is a weird cork, huh? It's orange? Yeah. So this it is. It looks like a 3D printed cork. It does actually. Now that you say that. Oh. Watch this. This is oh, well, I, re- ah, my I elbow. lubed it once, dude. Oh my elbow. Uh, Alex said you're worried about that shit. Worried about what? The dead fit? No, I'm just not going in the water. No, red tide. I'm just not going in the water. Sam Blue is o ring on that cork. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, this is Davenport's American whiskey. I've never had this before, but I love the straight bourbon whiskey, the barrel proof. I'm I'm in love with it. Scott, our buddy Scott, picked this up for us. It was very cheap. Like, insanely cheap. Like, 15 or $20, I think. It's not bad. 40% ABV. Cyanide's fine. You can swim in cyanide. As long as it's basic. Okay, don't listen to Sean. What? He doesn't know what he's talking about. Okay. What is that? Whoa, that's weird. It smells like light whiskey, huh? It does. Like, a lot. Like, it just like, smells... Uh, just, um, like, almost artificial cherry. Like, uh, slightly stale graham crackers and vanilla. Yeah, but you uh, drooled a cherry Jolly Rancher all over it. I'm not in love with that, but you drink a shit ton of it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that's so cherry. Jesus. the most easy to drink whiskey I've had in a long time. That tastes flavored. American blended whiskey. Produced and bottled by Temperance Brands. So it's MGP. Did you go to Siesta Key? No, we didn't. We went to, um, there's a beach north of that that we went to. Siesta was supposed to have, like, worse red tide. So you guys just didn't swim or what? No, fuck no. Why are there kids in the water? People, people what are they doing? They're tourists. I, yeah, like, I they get had to that. step over the dead fish to get like, in the water. That's what I'm saying. Like, if I, if I go to a beach and it's like that, it smells yeah. like that, I'm already out. That's bad. It's I cannot bad. even smell that all day. I'm not doing that. You get used to it after a little bit. <laughs> It's real bad, though. Oh, shit. Um, okay, hold on. You can't smoke a cigar. I can. You can? Yeah, I'll be fine. I highly doubt that. No, I'll be fine. Okay. I'm supposed to also kick back on alcohol, and here we are. Yeah, if I were you, I'd follow that instruction as well. Here we are. Gosh dang it. I am so deep in the Meprazole. I will smoke cigars on next Tuesday. That's what I'll smoke. We have a Wagyu next Tuesday, dude. A little one-two Wagyu's next Tuesday. Fuck yeah, dude. Dan asked why, because it's Florida. That's You know what? Irish Ted just answered every question I've ever had about that. Yeah. So, you know, apparently thought I was dying. Had a bunch of tests. They were like, hey, you're not dying. And then they're like, you know what? You might have an ulcer, though. So... The After plenty of research. Should get that fixed. You're probably bleeding on the inside of your body. Yeah, so taking a bunch of medicine to hopefully fix that, and then I go for a scope next week to confirm or deny that. Hopefully next week. Gotta oh, you're doing a scope? Yeah. They put it in your butt? Throat. Oh. So you go under. Well, deep, deep. Yeah. So they hit, put you under. Hit the back. Put a camera down into All here. All the way down. It's, your stomach's up here, bud. That's a long way. That's a long camera. <laughs> <laughs> And then they, they <laughs> flip around the camera, and then, and then they say, I don't know, and they keep going into your intestine a little bit and say, I don't know. Why don't they just come up from the bottom, then? <laughs> well, the intestine's very fucking long. <laughs> oh, for a while, we just thought they were going to have to take half of Sean's body out. Yeah. Uh, will you highlight that? It, there ain't no cigar in heaven, I shall not go. If there are no cigars in heaven, I'm sorry, Eric. Yeah, the white shows up terrible oh. on this screen. I wonder if it's because of that overhead light blasting too much light on that. A oh, thousand percent. Yeah. I love colonoscopies. Free anal, Tristan. <laughs> I read that out loud. Too. Yeah, you did. You went for it. Oh, you know? Tristan, I just saw your name and read it, man, and now I regret it. That's on you. 
Gosh. I could have GERD also, I think. Or an ulcer. GERD's treated by uh, anti, basically what you're treating. The same thing already years. taken. Yeah. Yep. Just bought my first house, took off the whole week. First time in a long time I can do a stream start to finish. Need cigars and collector's corner. We're It's 1130, right? Yep. Branson, buddy, I and appreciate they, you. I don't know how behind Roger is. He's just like, Trevor Lawrence. <laughs> we talked about that in half an hour ago. Roger, Roger buddy, you're, you're an hour back right now, buddy. <laughs> That's uh, we, dude, <laughs> uh, the one nice thing about YouTube that we, if we did stream on Twitch, you can't do is nobody can watch back during. You have to wait till it's over. Oh yeah. To be in chat. Whereas on YouTube, you can scroll through, which is really nice. Yeah. The deal with Dan. So that gave me an ulcer. No, it's because Sean drinks so much alcohol that he has an ulcer. I looked at Ricky and she goes, Oh, I know somebody gets those a lot from drinking too much. I go, Sean drinks too much. And she goes, that's not what I said. I'm just saying, I know somebody. I'm like, oh, is it your cruise ship guy? Or, and then she said, are you fucking serious right now? I had a really interesting text that I won't share with the world, but I'd love to share with the world after the last live stream about people who are very similar to me and the way that they think. I just want that to be known. You're a terrible person is what I just heard. No, 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 I'm not a bad person. It's the fact that like we get off that live stream, I'm like, tell me more about, tell me more about this cruise right now. And she goes, I was 16 dating the person that you know about in high school yep. that I did never cheated on. I'm like, yeah. Fine. <laughs> Fine. Fine. I actually believe you because of your fucking alibi here. <clears throat> I have GERD, can have citrus, acid, anything. No peanut butter. There's acid and peanut butter? Yeah, I'm just going to pop a Mephisol like fucking candy and continue on my life. Oh, Hopefully it fixes no. it. Oh, no. Johnny said, Roger, catch up, dude. The, w- the one lady was like, hey, if that's what it is, like if you have GERD, you know, like people, you know, it's, it's a common thing. Uh, we can talk to a dietitian common. and like we'll figure yeah, out what like triggers shit. it, yeah. and then like we can work Taco around Bell. it. Or you get on a meprazole, take a pill every day. People don't care; they just keep on living their lives. But it doesn't hurt you. No. What? We'll launch half the next month or two, Robert. What? I need a new one. Disney ruined mine. What? Uh, what logo should we put on the hats? Sean wants to put one of the old. Mm, I don't know what we called it, so I don't want to miss say it. The shield logo. Yeah. I, we, we could also do the, I would like to do the, the member. The one, BJ fan. The BJ. I want to do that. The, I like that That's one. That's what I want to do. Oh. You said, let's do the shield. I said, let's do the BJ. Did you say that? Yeah. Oh. You said, I like the shield. You looked at me and said that one. I do like shield. But I said, let's do the BJ. You said, I like the shield. If we did the BJ in gold, I, I like that one. The one right the, behind you on a patch. Ooh, a patch would be cool. I didn't think about doing like a patch instead of an embroidery. Like have a, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. That'd be kind of cool. I like embroidery. Somebody said cucumber. You know what, Liberty Not License? That's for you, You're bud. not helping. Like you said that like I'm supposed to chime in on that. <laughs> like, hey, bud, somebody said cucumber. Can you help me out? Make a new logo with time crystals. We should do a time crystals <laughs> pick. Oh. oh, Sean had a really good idea for our next, our Starlight Cognac pick. Oh, yeah. That was a really good sticker idea because it's yeah. finished. That's all I'll say. Is it's Gert and Gal the same thing? No. I hurt my, because th- my toe be hurting. Nope. Same Z, Sean. Stay hang in there, Matt. <laughs> nope. Oh, dude. The thing is, is Gerd sounds like you're dirty. <laughs> dude, <laughs> Eric Thompson. Remember, is the bomb. One a day, you can eat a double A pack. <laughs> Does it just dissolve acid for you? Um, so it reduces the amount of acid in, in your, your body. Yeah. I know, like, if you drink too much coffee, you can your body will start to become acidic. You know, it's fun. My my diet. It's coffee, pretty much bourbon, Bell, coffee, and, and bullshit. Yeah. yeah. Seriously, Jefferson Ocean pick with a love boat sticker and bourbon junkies love boat rocks glasses. Hashtag maritime secret time. Seriously. Oh, gosh dang it. Ricky and I'll start a podcast for you guys. How about that? <sighs> Today I said some wild shit to her, and I'm like, this would have been perfect for the podcast that I was talking about. Oh, we're talking about... um. We won't get into it, but we were talking about, we were talking about doing uh, uh, children's pageantry. That's all I'll say. We weren't talking about putting we're talking our, like dance mom shit, like like Miss Michigan for kids. Oh yeah, yeah. We went to it. school with Junior Miss Michigan. Don't you remember who? What's mm-hmm. the first name? If I can remember, I don't know who that is. I didn't know. Mm-hmm. That. Just noticing Dan has a dirty teenage mustache. Keep gra- I shaved today, bitch. Okay. Screw back today. No, you didn't. 
I shaved today or yesterday, swear to God. Yeah, with like an electric razor, though. Buddy, I only use an electric razor. Exactly. Because that's I, not real. Because I ain't no bitch. You know exactly, I mean? that's not real. I use straight blades only. I've been using my Vero now. I just... You know how I know that's a lie? <laughs> You're still alive. <laughs> just want to see how I got these scars? Just <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> oh. How do you do it? Oh. I tried to shave with a knife. It did not work. Dan, I think you might be kind of old to compete in pageants. <laughs> Hey, Explorer Joe, I appreciate the input, buddy. Uh, you know? Gosh, dang it. Oh, it's bad. Oh, There's so an opportunity bad. for you to get a Blue Run 14 secondary in Canada for 350 280 USD. Well, that's not much more than Every normal. 200, well, like one, it's 100 more than normal, base, or it's 100 more than retail. Yeah. But, but they're selling them at 225 They sold out in like 15 seconds I on seal box. And isn't everything insane in Canada? Yeah. Like, isn't, like, our normal whiskey insane over there? Electric razor for, are for pubescent boys. That's why I bought the Vero. It's just straight bladed with my sheep's foot now, dude. Gosh. David, I'd like to thank you guys for everything you do. I'm new to the bourbon world. And you have not only been a fantastic source of information, but also a ton of fun. Thanks. Thanks for being here, buddy. Oh, Thanks for coming along. We don't get that kind of a lot. Yeah, normally we get, take it more <laughs> seriously. Okay, Alec. Like that. How long? Lemon away. Oh, never mind. Said I tried adding two ashtrays, but they're going nuts now. Who's who sent you that sticker? Matt. <laughs> Matt did. Oh, Dan is shaving with a Venus. Wouldn't that technically be better? Do you guys like bourbon barrel aged beers? Yes, we do. Yeah. Speaking of that, we did one with two tones. Yeah. And it was fantastic. It turned out great. Anthony was in chat earlier. Very hard to get in Canada. I might. I'm listen. That's a lot of money, but I might just say yes. It's Dave said, I'm watching the show with my 10-year-old daughter. Where do you live? Go to bed. It's watch, 11. Watch the language, pal. Dave, we've been doing this for two and a half hours, and I said some wild things. Yeah. And now you're telling me that you're watching it with your 10-year-old daughter. And hello to your 10-year-old daughter. I hope you're having a great night. I'm that sorry. That sounded weird. That you're watching this. What? I don't know. What sounded weird? I, I said not weird. I don't know. You said it weird. So now you're telling us that you're watching it. Yeah, go again. I'm not running it back. Can you say, like, what's up to your 10-year-old daughter? Like, what would you I say? I said, hey, I hope you're having a great night. Yeah, it's weird. That's not weird. You just said it weird. Sean doesn't, okay, guys. Sean doesn't know how to interact with children at all. You say hi. Like, we see, no. We see kids in public, and Sean's like, hey. I'm like, they, they just. That one kid looked at me. I know. I was and there. Th that kid was weird. Can it we throw that out weird. there? That kid was weird. He was just interested because we had a camera. Yeah. All kids watch YouTube at this point. Yeah. So now all kids are like, oh, my gosh, YouTubers. Holding the exact same way. No. So if you see a camera, they're like, what's that? Like, what's up, buddy? That's not, this is a normal thing. That's a normal interaction I just no. had. Sean doesn't know how dumb. to talk to children. Let me just throw that out there. Gosh, kids dude. seemed a little slow. Sean, no. Oh, my <laughs> gosh, bro. If I was that kid's dad, I, you know what? If you're watching and you're that kid's parents, I will give oh, you said 10 day old. Sean's address. It's even weirder for you now. He said 10 day old? Yeah. So he's literally being sarcastic. Yeah. That makes so much more sense, Paul. Dave, shit. He corrected himself. <laughs> Damn it, Dave. Sean thought he was going to get jumped by the kid. If I was Sean's parents <laughs> right now, I'd fucking murder him if he said that about my kid. <laughs> um, I have a five-year-old, and he has a following on YouTube for real. It's crazy. It's fucking crazy. The kid was, listen, I'm telling you. How old do you think he was? That kid? Yeah. Probably 12, 10, something like that. He should learn to talk better. What the fuck are you talking <laughs> about? He spoke better than me. Well. 32. Let's set the bar a little But higher. what I'm saying is, like, if you're 10, like it your speaks better than me. your son talks better than you. Oh, my gosh. Exactly. Okay. Jeez, oh, pizza. You guys, if you ever see Sean, just jump him. Fucking beat his ass. <laughs> just fucking jump him. He says bad shit. I don't. If your 12-year-old daughter's watching a channel about bourbon, you can't bitch about the language. Well, she's 10 days old, come to find out. Yeah. So. Damn it, Dave. Sean about to get y'all canceled? Yeah, pretty much, Steve. Why? Because you can't call people's kids weird and slow. You can't say that about other people's children. Buying the kid. <laughs> That's not, you can't say that. Sean is fully prepared to try and beat this kid's ass. <laughs> 
Oh, my God. Dan's 48 oh. when he lies about it. Would Dan fight 1,000 babies or a giant baby? Oh, you go with 1,000 babies, bud. They can't walk. Neither can a giant one. Yeah, just it'll roll on you, though. They don't have, no, no. Babies What's don't have giant? control over their body. What's giant we talking? I'm saying the size of a house. No, it matters far more how old they are. <clears throat> Dan, do you own an ice cream truck? Jack said, I can't believe people post Team Sean because <laughs> of the things. I'm, I'm fucking telling you guys. Oh, you shouldn't say that, but you can't. Wait, what? You can't say it out loud, Scott said. Oh. The old face maker, here's 499 for you to go off camera, change shirts, come back to drop some bars about Greaves being a master taster. He's not. Thanks in advance. Why are you kicking the camera? <coughs> I just found the leg to the tripod with my foot. Yeah. We all saw that. Sean will never understand his kids. Someday he'll have his own kid, right? This will happen. Someday like Sean, Sean and Gabby that will have kid was weird. Sean and Gabby will have kids. Okay. And I swear to God, some kid, some guy, grown man, I don't care if it's fucking Thor Bjornsson, <laughs> call Sean's kid slow or weird. Sean's fucking dying for it. I guarantee it. <laughs> Without a doubt, Sean goes, let's go, Peppy. <laughs> fucking knife out. And he's 100% dying for it to Thor. Knife is in Thor. Hey, Sean's broken in half. Dude, Cal and Shab just had this conversation. Okay. He was like, hey, guns don't care how big you are. <laughs> <laughs> True. Fair. Fair. <laughs> And Davenport is from Temperance, Michigan. Dan, the age of the child is all that matters, Shuck. Okay, I was talking about fighting a thousand hey, babies. Gravy? I was fighting a thousand babies. You're doing what? You said, how big is the giant baby? I said, no matter how old the giant baby is, because when they're little, they can't control the their bodies. The size of the planet, it doesn't matter. See, my That's question fair. is That's still fair. relevant. That's Okay, true. Size of, hey, we don't have anywhere to put it, but it's the size of fucking Earth. Yeah. So. Gosh, it's, it's a quantum mechanics thing. Don't, don't worry about it. Don't watch your videos or streams with my sons, three and seven, except the very beginning of Poor Guesses, which they intimidate. Oh, I can't even read. That. They intimidate Dan all the time. <laughs> which they imitate all the time. Dude, you guys wait. I don't remember which Friday we just shot. Oh, but it I think it's we, the first one. It's the, o, it'll be this Friday. It sent I'm me to sure. oblivion. It was the worst <laughs> Poor Guesses I've ever been a part my of. My voice cracked. It straight pissed me off. <laughs> it made me... So angry. Oh, Dan just needs, uh, Dan just wants them all in a soccer field to fight. Just that one kid. Just, I didn't fight him. He just gave him a real dirty look. You call him slow? You hit? No, I didn't. I was fucking <laughs> pissed. He kicked the double ball at my daughter. Mom's over there being a fucking Karen. Okay. The opposite. She's completely uninvolved. Yeah. What's an uninvolved mother called? There's a guy to be shitty for it. <laughs> That's pretty true. I don't know. This guy was talking to two strangers in a store, buddy. His parents had their back turned. Okay, him now, and hawing about butter. Here's what I will say. What I will say is, the, maybe don't do that. The kid wasn't being weird. The kid was intrigued because we're carrying two cameras around. One camera in the middle of Indiana. One camera. The parents, by the way, not paying any attention. Not one. Not one bit. Literally none. Yeah. They're literally their son is a hundred feet away in a store, <laughs> and they're not concerned. And there's two middle-aged men. With cameras. You're very middle That aged. makes it way weirder. Yeah. Now that I think about this, <laughs> worst parents award. Worst, those, those parents don't even care what you said. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. They're not listening. Oh. I could say it to them and they wouldn't hear it. Got two Elmer's for retail? Damn, that's amazing. Is Bardstown Distillery the new best Western Kentucky distillery? I love everything from them. No. Mm. What's in Western Kentucky? Great question. You don't know where that state is, so <laughs> let's narrow that down for you. East of Tennessee. Nope, it's west of Tennessee. Holy shit. Okay. Is that it, true? It is west of Tennessee. You sure? 100%. Until a dragon goes Tennessee, slightly into Kentucky. Are you sure, though? 100%. All right. 100. Picked up Luna. <laughs> Kid thought Dan was Mr. Beast. <laughs> Maybe, dude. Maybe. You know, imagine that man. The amount of money. Yeah, it's north. I'm pretty sure Tennessee sits below. The best bourbon. In the, it's not north. It is literally directly west. Okay. Of I Tennessee. It's not true. north of Tennessee. Because I'm pretty sure when you drive south, you go Michigan, Ohio, uh, Kentucky. Kentucky, Tennessee, Georgia, Florida. No, no, no. It's Kentucky and then Tennessee over, dude. You guys are idiots. Kentucky and Tennessee are joined border to border. It's a <laughs> east-west relationship. Said Embellish Podcast. 
<laughs> I shut the stream down. <laughs> shut it down. <laughs> I don't oh. want to be here anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Is it really? I'm, I'm Googling this. <laughs> Googling it. Hold on. Oh, buddy. That... U.S. map with names. Oh, Google recommended states instead of names. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. Looking. I'm going to add. Oh, shit. I'm going to add two for that. Oh, it's Virginia. Virginia is next to Kentucky. Yeah. I thought Tennessee was where Virginia was. That's my bad. Dan's uh, smoking the crack tonight. <laughs> that's my bad. Get a punishment shot ready. <laughs> Dave said, shut it down, Team Dan. That was one of the rougher ones. Listen, but I know very small amounts about time crystals. So, you know. Even less about geography. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it's north, man. Why no cigar? Sean's literally dying. Uh, yeah, body. we're going to give it a week. I'm not smoking a cigar around Sean right now. Kind of need him not to die, unfortunately. Dan had like three last Friday. What? In one night. Five. Five cigars in one night. Started with a Kintsugi. <laughs> went to a fine and rare. Went to a gatekeeper. Fine and rare. Mama Cheetos or whatever Alec and, and Klein always smoke these little tiny cigars. And then this little shit-ass David Davidoff thing that you put in your pocket. It's like a little pocket box. They're not real cigars. <laughs> Google supercomputer. <laughs> out comes even. Dan's wrong. Odd. Dan's wrong. Guys, I get it. I was a little bit wrong. Wait. MB Rowland is Kentucky? I thought they were Tennessee. MB? Yeah. And Belch Podcast said, Green River, MB Rowland, Dueling Ground, Bard, Casey Jones, everything on this end oh, of the state well, is craft. Green River is putting out a lot of or, uh, you know, sourcing for a lot of people right now, but Bardstown is better than all the ones you just mentioned, for sure, without a doubt. Um, MB Rowland has a giant Kentucky on the front of the label, so that makes sense. Okay. I, I, didn't, I didn't know that. I just thought they were Tennessee. I don't know why. So Dan doesn't know geography very well. At least he doesn't make fun of children. Zachary Jones. Appreciate the comment. Very true. <laughs> I'll pick my battles on Very this true. You know what? Finally tracked down my cigar blend. Smoke wagon uncut different enough to warrant to want separate batches. Actually, I don't know. We only have one batch. Yeah, we've only had one. We've tasted maybe two, but Ooh, we Blue have Note one. 17 made in Memphis, east of Kentucky. <laughs> the problem is... <laughs> I didn't uh. even proofread the last part. Until we got to it and just, oh. All right, guys. What time is it? Ouch. 144. Are you ready to shut it down? I, I'll go until, I'll go 16 more minutes. I'm going to finish my drink. Anything you want to talk about? Not geography. Like, <sighs> hey, did you see the new um, Suicide Squad? Yeah. You did? I fell asleep during the end of it. That was, I was watching it Sunday shut when I was sick. Down. I was sick. I don't care. Shut it down. You, this man falls asleep during everything. I was sick. You literally, what's the thing when you're, you literally fall asleep narcolepsy. all the time? You have narcolepsy. You have it. They asked me If today. Sean's in his home, narcolepsy. They were like, excess fatigue? I said, I can nap. <laughs> all the time. During movies, TV yeah. shows. He fell asleep during the Loki finale. Uh, yeah. Doesn't. <laughs> I was on the couch, snugged up. Is the new one better than the old one? The new Suicide Squad? Yeah. I like the old Suicide Squad. I didn't better. have a problem with it. Way better. Who's the director of the new one? It's a famous guy. I don't know. Like a really famous guy. I don't know. Hated that shit. Ask <laughs> Jeez, hope. Steve, that is a very aggressive review. Did you find Alaska and Texas on the map when you did that? <laughs> I got Alaska, Hawaii, and Texas. Thank God. And Michigan, and Florida, Ooh. and California, and, and we're Washington. Done? Oh. Yeah. I, Washington's easy because it's a corner. James Gunn? James okay. Gunn. Yeah. What's up, Gunn? Who directed the first one? So James Gunn is the one that did um, Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah, and those movies are amazing. Yeah. They're fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> Sean, literally every time I'm like, how was it? Fell asleep halfway through. Fell asleep at the end. Fell asleep five minutes in. But Sean will step and watch Jeopardy and fucking Price is Right Seven all o'clock. night. <laughs> like, like, Sean's never fallen asleep during an old game show, but he's fallen asleep during every new film and show ever been watched. First one was David Ayers. Okay. I didn't like the first one that much. New one's really good, Aiden said. 
DC movies are a suck. <laughs> uh, I mean the um, Snyder Cut of Justice League. Way better. I didn't watch Justice League. Batman vs. Superman was one of the best movies I've ever Just seen. Just don't watch the, the first Justice League that they put out. Just watch the Snyder Cut. It's four hours or something asinine like that. Worth it. Four. I'm not watching a four-hour movie. Worth I it. I can't say I'm waiting for a two-hour movie. Worth it. DC movies are generally a little obviously worse than Marvel. Yeah. You know what? DC movies would be really good if Marvel didn't exist. I mean, yeah. Because you'd have no comparison. The problem is the comparison. Okay. The problem is Marvel movies are so good. Yeah. That it makes DC movies look bad. Okay. If Suicide Squad came out and there was no Avengers, Guardians, none of wait, Guardians is DC, isn't it? No, Guardians was in Avengers, so that's Marvel. Damn. Favorite guest host of Jeopardy? Uh, I don't oh, like any go. of them, really. Old people. The guy they got go. now, I can't remember his name, but Drew he's Carey. like a... No, he's a uh, baseball uh, sportscaster, I think. He's pretty good. Allen Iverson. Nope. Hey, did you see? Okay, so Peacock, have you heard of Peacock TV? Yeah. Okay, so streaming TV service? Yep. Peacock, for the Olympics, did literally the greatest thing any TV like station or whatever you want to call it... Uh, Network has ever done. They hired Joe Buck. There you go. They hired Kevin Hart and Snoop Dogg to comment, co-commentate all Olympics. Bro, it is the funniest TV I've ever watched in my life. At one point, Kevin Hart and Snoop Dogg um, interview Phelps. Okay. And they have Phelps break down Kevin Hart swimming laps. And Kevin Hart goes, let's see the tape on the mini Aquaman. And Phelps just starts roasting the fuck out of it. Dude, it is some of the best TV. They, they, it seems yeah. relatively unfiltered. Yep. Snoop Dogg is on some, you know. I always. Snoop Dogg shit. Yeah. Bro, if they don't hire them to sportscast for the rest of their lives now, I don't want to watch sports anymore. It's Ken so Jennings good. wasn't that good. I like Ken Jennings. I don't think he was a great host. He tried to add too much. Oh, my. What? What do you want from me? <laughs> oh. What's up? You're complaining? This is the oldest thing you've ever done in your life, dude. What's You're up? You're complaining and saying that a host of a 400-year-old game show, yeah. this game show damn near does go back to dinosaurs, has literally, he added too much yeah. to the show. Yeah. Okay, so here's the thing. Oh, Alec would say something and then, like, say it correctly or whatever. Sure. You're like, how smart, how fucking smart is Alec, okay. right? Ken says it as one of the most winningest people ever. You're like, fuck you. They have teleprompters. They have earpieces. He doesn't it's know all It's all edited, this. too. Right. So it's like he could do a one-off on anything. Right. They pick and choose what they want to throw right. in there. I didn't like it. I don't like what they did for him. This is so funny to me. This seems like such a funny complaint to me. Yeah. Listen. I feel bad for anyone that has to take over after Alec Drex. Obviously, because there's like, old people like you sitting on their couches being pissed off. Everyone, well, he's Canadian. Everyone loved Trebek. I mean, everybody loved him. He seemed like a sweetheart. Yeah. Even though it was kind of a pervy It's like show, Bob huh? Barker, though. Pervy? Yeah. Was he the one with the Vanna? No. Okay, my bad. It's Pat. I retract my statement. Pat's a little pervy, huh? And, I mean, she posts, or she uh, posts for Playboy. Right. This, yeah. this kind of makes it kind of weird. Yeah. Family show, Playboy model. What? Yeah. Did you guys catch Clarkson's Farm? Oh, I got to watch it. What the hell's that? So Jeremy Clarkson has his own show, and it's him on a farm. It's just Jeremy Clarkson, but it's, I believe it's his farm. Okay. That's the show. It's Jeremy Clarkson on a fucking farm. You watch Jeremy Clarkson do anything. Why? James May is constantly on social media making fun of Jeremy Clarkson on his farm now because of the show. That's just it? The show is Jeremy Clarkson on a farm. Like a comedy. I'm in, I guess. Yeah, I, I, you got, like... It's Adam Clarkson. said, Sean, I'm 41. So if I have Barrett's esophagus, heal up and enjoy as you like proton pump inhibitors. That's, That's got to be something that I hope I don't have. That sounds terrifying. Pat Sajak. There you go. Family Feud was pervy. Uh, no, I liked the new guy while well, he passed away. Steve Harvey? Yeah, I liked him. No, he didn't. He didn't pass away. Wait, is Steve Harvey alive? Yeah. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Wait, that, they, they just make everything like hyper sexual, like innuendo style yeah, to get those wrong answers. Show. Yeah. But hold on. Is Steve Harvey alive? Yeah. 100%. No, he's not. Steve Harvey's no, not he's dead. Not. He passed away. Steve Harvey's not dead. 
Jeremy's trying to be a real farmer. Oh, Bernie Mac. Are you really that I'm, racist? I'm thinking of Steve Harvey. Okay. No, I like Steve Harvey. He's the guy who got the fucking, um, uh, not America's Top Model, the Miss Universe wrong. Yeah. He read the card wrong. They gave him the wrong card or whatever. No, no, no he just read it wrong. He read the, the runner-up as the yeah. winner. I, I like Steve Harvey. Yeah, he does smoke seven stuff. cigars a day. Steve Harvey? Oh, like a good amount of cigars. Damn. Because someone was like, hey, you do yoga? I do this. This is my meditation. Don't come at me with this bullshit. Seven cigars? Yeah. It's a lot, but, you know. Yeah, we're real live, bud. Bur- no, I didn't ever say Bernie Mac. I didn't even know Bernie Mac hosted well, that show. We just assumed you're racist. I didn't know he hosted that. a black guy died. <laughs> My gosh. Sean's getting us can't. We're taking the stream down. Nah, I'm rolling with it. Sean's <laughs> done some shit, man. Oh. There's surgery to correct the esophagus thing, but you can't drink for six weeks. Well, we're going to have to pre shoot a lot of content. Yeah. Sean might die during that, actually. In the six weeks? Fuck. No, no. Pre shooting. Oh, yeah. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Either one. Because I'm going to go for yeah, it. Yeah, dude. Jeremy, that Jeremy's farm thing, I'm so in on this idea. Why is he. Is he really trying to be a farmer? Why not? It's content. He's got a camera crew. Of course. He's got a network. Yeah. And you're Jeremy Clarkson. Yeah. I'd watch Jeremy Clarkson do just about anything at this point. Yeah. They're not making fucking what's it called right now, which I'm very upset uh, Grand about. Tour. They're literally in the middle of a special. Did you know that? Yeah. They, they've COVID shot ha- like two thirds of a special. Up. Yeah. And they, they haven't finished it still. Yeah. Because I remember they, they were like, hey, we're done with the Grand Tour. And people were like, what? And they were like, it's going to something better. What is it going to? No, that was the end of like the last season. Oh, okay. It's like they, they, they were like. They put out new episodes. Yeah, Did they're you know? like, we're done with the Grand Tour because it's like not going to be the tent shit anymore. I didn't know they put out more episodes. Yeah. Dude, they've done four episodes of another season. And then they pitch, they commercial, they advertised a special for the mm-hmm. next episode. And if you look it up, it's like two-thirds shot. Real COVID hung up. They huh? got stuck in a country. They couldn't leave. And they couldn't film. So they couldn't do anything. They couldn't work, but they couldn't go home. <clears throat> oh, dude. I Lockdown love Lockdown session came out two weeks ago. It did? Is that real? Oh, there's a Grand Tour episode released this week. Bro, is that fucking real? I'm watching. I'll fucking fall asleep tonight. Forever known as a Let's Get Canceled stream. I don't think I said anything too bad. You have said the worst shit we've ever said on this channel. Out loud. No. Because like all the stuff I say is like weirdly sexual about me. Yeah. On my mom, on my aunt, shit like that, right? Okay. FMA. Okay. FM. M. Okay. Okay. You said bad things about people's children. Okay. I don't know what else. You said some other shit. Oh, you said I was racist. That's bad. It was a joke. I said I kissed dudes. I'm not getting canceled for kissing dudes. Bro, that's a joke. <laughs> you you got. I know I'm not racist. You got to knock it back one. I you, I said you said I was racist. I said people think you're racist because we said a black guy and then you went to Bernie Mac. I didn't go to Bernie Mac. Chat went to Bernie Mac, and you went with them. Yeah. This is the problem. You're on my team. We're kind against of. chat. It's oh. me and you versus the world. Oh, I didn't know that. Well, only sometimes. Sometimes they're nice. Don't have your wife on. Pro tip. I'm apparently supposed to do that next week. No, not next week, idiot. Two weeks. September, buddy. It's Three like, weeks. That's like four weeks from now. It's literally five. Five, like five weeks. weeks. I gotta prompt her a little bit dan just oblivious i'm a good person not um, all the joke anymore yeah welcome to cancel culture what's man. it called we're not big enough and nobody actually say anything bad okay what are we what is it called grand tour i'm so happy if that actually i don't have twitter i can't get canceled we're good i don't think i ever put any youtubers good. have been canceled i don't think i ever put anything wild on uh da- facebook david gobrick or gobrick he no he got canceled for almost killing a guy there's a fucking wild difference there. no i know i'm just saying youtubers get oh canceled. did you watch that shit of course not oh it's bad buddy why would i watch it it's an enthralling story <laughs> no i'm all good on that because that guy like kept up this whole facade that like he almost didn't die the one doctor that treated him he was like dude a couple millimeters the other way we're what not did he talking do to him? so you shoot him Adam said on the last stream, Ricky grabbed Dan's nipple. Did, Did she? I don't know. Um, okay, so they're shooting the segment. Happens where daily. They have a, an excavator out in the water, and they've got, like, the bucket up, and he's spinning people around. Okay. So he gets in this loop, and he's like, all right, let's do it. And David just gets whipping fast, and the guy's like, dude, stop. Everyone's like, dude, too much. Right. He just hard stops. Oh, shit. Physics. Right. He uh, keep moving. He came around and smacked the boom. It hit him in, like, the face. It broke his face. 
and like this bolt or something like hit up into oh his gosh. like shit. He almost lost his eye. Um, he wore an eye patch, had a bunch of reconstructive surgery. It was so, so he fucking accidentally bad. Oh, almost killed people him, were man. like, "No, he's a sociopath, though." Like David, like he kind of oh, wanted this to okay. happen so type he's a deal. Crazy. Oh, for sure. Okay, everybody just said uh, an episode came out this week. I can't find it. Logan Paul didn't get canceled. No one can. You know. Uh, well, Logan Paul is also like one of the fucking. Logan Paul's also like very much transitioned his whole shit into a really cool thing and yeah. done a really good job with his shit. Dude, the impulsive podcast. I'm a fan. Uh, listen, Logan Paul, mind you, he was really young when that happened, but Blue Note 17, when we get one. July That's... 30th. How long ago was July 30th? Well, that was only like two weeks ago. Well, you it? don't know your month, so we're good. Uh, I was you very... forgot August exists. I told somebody that November came after September the other day. So it's not. You know, I just feel like a lot of stuff in my brain isn't, you know. We we'll just add two. <laughs> That's fair. That's actually fair. Okay, yeah. Okay, so season four, episode three, aired July 30th, 2021. Okay, is it good? Double oak? You need to try the double oak. Daniel, is it the hammer one or is it? Wait, is it the broken barrel or the hammer? Who asked? Was it Stephen? Is that S Stefan? This one's from Stefan. It must got to be the other one. Daniel Sihan. Could be Sheehan. He just said, yeah. Yeah, this is it. Okay. Make it happen. We'll try this and we're shutting it down. Yup. This is the last thing we're doing. The front half Adam is filled said, with some of their better oh, jokes of late. I like that, man. I'll Adam said, I bought a case of Blue Note 17 in El Paso, Texas. Holy Can email you guys. shit. Do it. Bourbonjunk at gmail.com. Because um, we'll never see that. Oh, we got to like shoot tomorrow, don't we? Yeah. Shit. All right. Yeah. I got to shoot B-roll for everything. I said over that. Mm. Not on that table anymore. A okay. bummer, real yeah. bumski. Yeah. Okay, this is Daniel Sheehan sent us Hugh Hammer. That's the actual name. Hugh Hammer, maybe Hugh Hammer, selected from because it can't be in the garage because they're doing construction, so the Wi-Fi of the access point is outside. It's lived through two rainstorms. Why don't you move it inside? Can't we? What do you mean it can't be? They're not doing anything right now. Put it inside. Move it out during the day. Oh, that's good, though. I like that. Wow. For a, I guess it's source, but... Dude, that's like uh, if... It's, it's almost like it's like a baby 1910 or something. I know it's like the, the the wood fishing series on the makers. Like it's got no. that dry cinnamon oak. No, no, it's not sweet enough. Yeah, it is. I think it's more charry. Chocolate. I get so much cinnamon and oak. I, I'm with you on the oak, a hundred percent. It's like the oak, even on the nose, comes out a lot. How do you not get that drying, that cinnamon? It reminds me of the um, SE4 one. I don't remember any youth in those, though. I don't think do it's youth. That? I think it's like a, a floralness. I, I don't think this, this feels... This has to be young MGP. It doesn't feel super young, though. Dude, that's interesting. Cut out the uh, what? Um... Hugh it's a hammer. huge hammer. Straight bourbon it's whiskey, double oak. huge hammer. You know what? This fucking computer is probably doing updates or some shit. Who knows? Could just do this. So the stream quality is good. Yeah, we're, seven, we're ripping 5K bits. Yeah, I bumped it up so the quality wasn't shame more. We had it 2,500. We did. I probably really forgot to update yeah, that we one. Didn't. I changed it to like 5,000. Change the audio up? Uh, it didn't need to be. Okay. It, was, it was already at 164 or some shit. 
Um, we haven't dropped any frames. So if it got choppy, I'm not sure why. Might be on your Refresh. End. We haven't dropped a single frame. But I guess coming back to it, I bet you if this opens up like a little bit, I don't know if it's that. I get that dry oak in the, no, the nose too. Yeah, I get that same oak for real. And Bring that back might collector's be a, corner. We'll do a collector's corner next week, next Tuesday. That might be a little bit of the, the youthiness that you're thinking. Or. I like that. I wonder if it was like a really hot double oak. Like the, the second barrel was small or something. Because it feels very oaked influenced. Man, I don't know. That's really good, though. Dude, hear me out. Yeah. I'm so on board with this. Tasting notes? Yep. Um, fresh charred oak and a spicy dark chocolate on the nose. Weird, I said both those things. Proceeds oak, cherry, and subtle cinnamon on the palate. Subtle Pepper cinnamon. and pleasant dry oak finish. Mm. They kind of mm. nailed it. Yeah. They kind of nailed that's those that, things for that, us. They, know, they that, nailed those. That's real tasting notes. Because we would have said, we've All said that. almost every one of those things. Yeah. Without reading that. That's so weird. I like that whiskey. My expectations were far lower. I, what's honest. the price on this? I don't know. Daniel, mm. what is the price on that, buddy? They also have a cast strength rye. Daniel, how much is that? Dan has, Sean had the Penelope Rose. No. We'll get that out next stream. Yeah. You open it? Mm-hmm. How is it? Because Tommy D was talking about it. And I'm like, oh, shit, they, it's here. Yeah. Um, I want to retry it. It's fucking, you could drink so much of it. Like, okay. it gets you in trouble type shit. Oh. Super sweet, low proof. Yeah. yeah. Have you guys tried the Weller by Cohiba Cigars? No. 30-ish? Is that real? That's not bad at all, dude. That's awesome. Shit. I was thinking even 50 wouldn't be a bad deal. See, 50 are starting to compete with bottles that aren't craft, that... For me, yeah, 45, 1910, I can find, you know, something that, like that. I thought that was 55. It is. But I'm okay. saying at 50, you start yeah. to compete a little bit. Dude, at 30, that's amazing, man. That's 30-ish, yeah. Thanks for sending that, buddy. 100. Well, that is him. Yeah, okay. 30-ish. 